Huh?
that supposed to mean got your eyes on me hello thank you so much sama hello welcome for to uh welcome in for 39 months that's pretty crazy that's pretty wild i'd say that's pretty wild i'd say happy monday it feels like a monday it really is a monday I, i'm really feeling the gravity of the monday <laughs> also how you doing mermaid man how you the win um <clears throat> yeah it's a. Uh, it's the case of the Mondays. Uh, all all the kids today were very, very, um, very vocal today. <laughs> Am I feeling better? Yeah, I'm feeling way better. Uh, during the weekend, I was, I was, I was really sick. Like I, I was really just kind of out of it. Um, but I think I'm doing a lot better now. Got some laundry done today. Watch some old Naruto, you know, doubling back into the past a little bit. I, I, I couldn't help myself. I, I decided hey, it's on Netflix. I got nothing else to watch. I said, I'm going to put my comfort show back on. And that's how that became that. So I started, I started watching Naruto. I'm on season, I'm on season five right now um no i'm sorry i'm on season six now uh and I, i'm like wow this is this is a, a blast from the past and it hurts <laughs> but anyway um it's it's been it's been all right i'm a little tired today please bear with me um i was supposed to do a charity event this week but i think i'm gonna push it off um just uh, just a little too much i was gonna do a charity event for Asheville. Um, I haven't really seen anyone supporting in that area, at least in the streamer side. 
So I figured I already have connections through Compassion. I figured I might as well do that. But this week is just going to be really loaded for me. Um, and especially on Thursday, I'm not going to even be able to stream on Thursday because I got some other uh, prior, uh, what is it, uh, things I got to do. I got to go to practice with the with the youth, and we got some songs we're supposed to be performing. So it's gonna it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be a little bit tiresome this week. I work straight six to one all week. Um, I think on Friday I get a small break. I, I ask my coworker if I could uh, come in a little later, and she's like, "Yeah, I could use the hours." So I swapped out with her on Friday, um, and maybe Friday I'll do. <laughs> can I be honest with you guys? Can, 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 just for a second, can I can I just be straight honest? Um, I really, 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 really don't want to do the Halo Lasso challenge. Like I genuinely. I just don't see any joy in it. I, I, and I've, I've genuinely just like pushed it off for the last three weeks because I just don't want to do it. I, I'm just being honest with you. Is there anything else we can replace it with? Um, because I, I, not only do I have to install Halo and then also do all the, the you know, just all that. I, I'm just, I'm really not in the mood to do so. Like, I, if I play Halo, I just want to have fun. You know what I mean? Um, and I was thinking maybe we can, as a community, just swap it out to something else. Um, if, if that's possible, you have to say something nice to everyone in chat. That's not the same block game arc. Listen, you're saying arc because you, you know that it's enjoyable. It's got to be something everyone enjoys. So you have to choose it. Dress to impress. Oh, please. No, no. Anything but that. I am not downloading Roblox. Okay. Not doing that either. I'm not. Twilight Princess? Yeah, that's doable. I, I could definitely do that. I ain't doing no dress to impress. Marbles? I could do that. I mean, but that depends that on you. It's right. not like a Freedom Cowboy? Wait a second. You're new here. You did not just drop the tier once. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. What did I do? I mean, I appreciate it. Uh, like, I don't, I don't really know how to respond to that, but... Hey, I mean, it's it's your paycheck, you know. You're wasting it, not me. And um, build Minecraft, battle Minecraft. I, I I don't know about that. Maybe no, I don't. I like Minecraft, but uh, last time I played it, you called me a mole rat. So now I don't like it. You called me a mole rat because I was under the ground, hiding from everything. <laughs> <laughs> you call so I don't know about that. It's just something, right? But um you're cool with Twilight Twilight Princess? Are you though? Are you? Um You know, there is something I realized the more I attended your streams. Why? You are more funny and entertaining when you are annoyed and angry with us. Here we bent, go again. Bent, 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 bent. Here we go again. Men thinking that fart jokes are funny. All right, I get it. <laughs> Were we wrong? No, About, you know, not. I wasn't a and mole don't rat. Don't ever say I did. Uh, do Twilight Princess? I might. I don't know. Like you said, I might do a poll. Whatever you want to do. But hi, Skippy. How you doing? Welcome back. Um, have you tried playing the aisle? Actually, I have. I I have played it. Um, it was all right. It was a dinosaur game. I just prefer Ark movie reactions. Um, you mean like watching movies or like reacting to certain types of movies? I'm not a big movie watcher. Like I'll tell you what, my family loves to go to the theater, and I'm not really one that likes to. I've always been the type that likes to go out and do things. I, I'm, I've never I have too much ADHD to sit down and watch a movie and I've always been like that <laughs> If that makes any sense Karaoke. Oh, no, no, please. I beg you. Please, please. I will do anything else right now. I please I got no energy man I got no energy for that. Please Man, I'll give you your points, but I can't. I'm sorry. I, I know I know you're like, oh, say something. I, I'm sorry. I just, I don't have the energy for that. <laughs> I, zero. Zero. <laughs> Maybe later. Is that fine? You can request it later. Uh, yes, is this the manufacturer? 
Uh, I'd like to report a defective Lupin model. What is it that supposed to be? It appears to be mean? stuck on yap mode. Oh my gosh, man. I just got here. Don't go messing with me, you little brat. I'm going to throw you in a blender. How about that? Uh, but anyway, um, yeah, I was, watch I was watching some Naruto today after work, and it was, uh, it's, 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 it's really surreal, okay? The first time that I watched Naruto, I was like this 13, 14-year-old snot-nosed brat watching Naruto, and I'm like, oh, this is the coolest thing in the world! And now I'm like 26, doing laundry, and just watching Naruto, and I'm like, wow, how life is going. <laughs> <laughs> we, we really out here. <laughs> Gosh. Uh, <laughs> um, I was like 10, maybe. I you was know, thinking about it. I think maybe 10. Seeing the Naruto opening for us? Heck no. <laughs> Heck no. Not even, not even, not even on your wildest streams would I do that. Iran, welcome back again to the stream. Have you watched uh, Scooby-Doo and guess who? This <laughs> Celebrity now I have I, wait which one the old one yeah I did actually the really really old one what would you like to play what would I like to play personally on a Friday uh, also Jonah uh welcome to the new champ um I'm I'm not I'm not too sure. Uh, that's why I'm asking. Like I just don't want to do the Halo Lasso. And I, I just I just I don't think anyone is going to have fun actually watching that and I don't really want to play it. And I just I don't know. Maybe you guys really want me to play it, but I really doubt that's the case. Um I like threw together that charity thing goal like at the last minute because my my priorities was not on those goals. My priority was on fundraising for those kids. So uh, Spore, I did play Spore during the fundraiser. Overwatch 2 is fun. Yeah, I mean, yeah, Overwatch is fun, but uh, I play those kind of on my own time already. I wouldn't do it on Friday. Um... How about this? How about this? Um, how about Friday? We can do, um, hmm, we could do... If you want my opinion for a game, try Pokemon Rejuvenation. Ah, it's a phenomenal fan game. I'm not much Though into fair Pokemon warning, anymore. It has a fair bit of swearing, some dark themes. Dark also themes? Also quite long. But it's a dark master themes. class of fan games. What, did the Pokemon eat each other? <laughs> you had your priorities on point. Thank you. I tried. I certainly did try. Uh, Twilight Princess was nice. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, it's up to you guys. Um, if anything, I'll just start with Could just chatting. Could play Zelda Ocarina of Time on Majora's Mask since you've played Twilight Princess. Well, I didn't finish Twilight Princess, though. Like, at least not on stream. I, I could do that. Huh? Also, um, kind of excited to see me like... <laughs> You're excited to see me? Well, why is that? Um, Darth Vader comes to play uh, his theme. No, it doesn't. Skyward, sorry. I, I wasn't big on that one. My mom was, but I wasn't. Maybe you could do a game you're gonna finish. I, I don't like that personal attack. <laughs> Stanley Parable, or uh, have you played that already? I actually have not played that one, Elf. Um... I, I don't know. <laughs> uh, Twilight Princess, maybe. I don't know. Not Star Wars. I'm good. Um, maybe not Pokemon. Uh, shoot, man. I really need to get into games that I just enjoy. Um, you can try to find a way to play. You know what? How about this? Uh, either A, we can do marbles, or B, um, I could go ahead and not think about it. I can pull out the that stupid dan that dance mat and uh, Hello? <laughs> oh gosh. Hello? <laughs> Hi Katsy. Oh gosh, I didn't expect to write. Well, welcome in Katsy. Um I'm incredibly honored. <laughs> Thank you so much for the raid. What in the world? I <laughs> Um, I just, yeah, we were just chatting, um, about Friday's stream. How was your stream? <laughs> Sorry, you caught me off guard a little bit. I got a little flustered. Um, welcome in, guys. And I hope that, uh, tonight has been fun for you. Uh, <laughs> <coughs> 
Sorry, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not flustered. I was just a little I was just a little caught off guard. I appreciate it. Um, but um, <clears throat> welcome in. Um, I don't know what you're playing. What were you playing? <laughs> Chaotic. Everybody. <laughs> Well, I don't know about all that. Listen, my energy level is about f about a good four today. About a good four out of ten. <laughs> a four out of ten energy scale. I, I can't do anything about that. I'm not flustered. I'm not flustered. I was. I'm again. I was just caught off guard. I, I'm not. I'm not really used to people coming in, and I get a little shy with your uh, with your communities because you know, you know. I, I I don't I, I know how to behave. I'm just I don't really I'm not I'm not shy. All right, I'm not shy. Let's just get that out of the way. Anyway, um, so this Friday, what we can do, I was thinking, um, we can go ahead and just do a marbles or b uh Minecraft or maybe here's the third one and don't go jumping on it just because I said so. Uh, we could do DDR. All right. Um, oh, wait, you're right. It is one of the goals. You're right. Never mind. Uh, that we will get there. <laughs> we will get there. Um, marbles. Serge says um, marbles. Um, we could do that. Um, or I... Um, Anyway, I, yeah. <laughs> Ruby, welcome to the meme champs. Also, um, Katzi, I appreciate it again. If you need to take this break um, and do whatever you gotta do, whether it's eating or sleeping, feel free to do so. I am not holding you hostage. Thank you so much for sharing your community. Um, I, it's, it's, it makes me shy. <laughs> but okay, that's all I'll give you. That's all I'll give you, okay? <laughs> take care. Um, since DDR is one of the goals, maybe marbles. All right, all right, yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe marbles. I, I, we can think about that. Um, it's okay that you are, yeah, whatever. Okay, I'm. Anyway, uh, fridge review. Oh yeah, we could, we could do a review on the fridge. I um, it's a possibility. I could review what's in your fridge. What do you think? What do you think? Should I review the fridges? <laughs> you know, that sounds like a pretty good idea. I don't know. Maybe. Like I said, it's gonna it's kind of a last minute decision and it's supposed to span for the whole day. Um or I mean it's supposed to. I have not I have told you guys that I'm like, oh, I'll stream on at three o'clock Fridays. And I have not yet done it at all. <laughs> like ever since I said it about two or three months ago. I <laughs> every Friday Friday has not been early <laughs> no, they're supposed to be they're supposed to be i i've just i've just been a little busy i guess <laughs> why not watch the animated version of uh i thought you put despicable me and i don't understand we do have his description can we take that <laughs> let's take his description dive in vr welcome to the welcome to the meme champs what are you quoting me for is that that um, anyway, let me go ahead and welcome you guys in. Hello, Teriyaki, Bearded Raven, Tachikoma. Hello, uh, Bipolar Brownie, Dar uh, Daniel. Hello, Raven. Welcome in. Oh, Nort. Josh, Yeet, Daddy Yum Yums, Crimson Fox, Freezes. Hello, Johnny. Hello, Mr. Eek Leek. <laughs> Uh, Turtle, hello, welcome in, uh, King Swaggers, welcome back, Sama, hello, SD, Xander, welcome in, Bredinator, Dakaru, welcome in, Costa Rica, Abolish Regret, Port, Sharky, Wrestling, Modest Mistake, Raker, welcome in, Pika Williams, Adenator, Satoshi, Chaos Gamer, welcome in, Hazru, Aaron, Omega Fox, Firestrike, Radfire, Ben the Newbie, Wolfkin, Cool Guy, and, uh, oh, it's Blipster Whipster, welcome back. Good to see you again. Um, HB Eggs, Proof, Hello Squiddy King, Jay, Willia, um, Neon White Platypus, Welcome back, Hello Shinku, Mermaid Man, Hello Rukia, um, <clears throat> Shay, Hello Shay, Welcome back, um, sh uh, CH502, I'm gonna call you TV Head, Hello Code Panda, Welcome in, Fatal Sniper, Project Sky, Agent Spider, Tech, Nightwolf, Jasper, Fitz, Crumble, G Dog Warbucks, welcome back. Hello, Night Chill, I ran. Um, Surgeon Otter, welcome back. Um, Daz <laughs> it's good to see you again, Daz it. Uh, Blue Clone, Carbon Fox, well, welcome back, Dragonfly. 
reply. Um, and Scooty Booty Doo and Hero of Game and Cricket. Hello, Chaos Secrets. Bello, Squee, Donkey Kong, Dranzer, Fudgenator, Alex, Freedom, uh, Satikuro, Alexis. Hello, Nature and Zimblu. Welcome back, guys. Um, it is a Monday. Monday. We like Mondays, right? No, we don't. We don't like Mondays. I'm not really a big fan of Mondays. But hey, it's fine. Tomorrow will be Tuesday, and then it's going to be Wednesday, and then Thursday, and then before you know it, it's going to be Friday. That's how it works. <laughs> Mondays suck. They do. But um, like I said, guys, um, I I will be... I'll be at least I'm not working doubles this week like I did last week, but still, um, if I'm a little tired this week, just bear with me. I won't be here Thursday, like I said. Um, I got practice to do, only for the the cycle to repeat. What cycle to repeat? What cycle? Um, Monday no longer sucks for me because I don't work on Monday anymore. Honestly, I would not want to have a day off on a Monday. I'm not going to lie because... Not only am I going to feel like I didn't enjoy my Monday because I did absolutely nothing, but I'm also going to feel like it's just I did nothing but sleep. Sorry, hold on. I dropped my... Where'd it go? Dang it. <clears throat> this is why... So D8 gave me this, like, um, gifted me on my birthday one of these little, like, um, they're like little paw prints, but it's like a ring paw print. And I fidget with stuff a lot, so I literally just fidget with that thing all day long, and I dropped it, and now I'm bothered. So I'm gonna have to fidget with the next thing I find on my desk. Which is a shark. <laughs> anyway, you work seven days a week on swing shifts. You hate it here. <laughs> oh man, I'm so sorry. I could never do a swing shift only because I need consistency. And if it's not consistent, I will lose my mind. I will genuinely lose my mind. I need my hours to be straight days. At least, at least, at least. I'm off Monday through Thursday every week. I work the weekend shift in exchange. I get four days off. That, okay, that's pretty cool. I wouldn't mind something like that. Like, imagine if I had to just work only a few, like, a long hours for a few days, but then have longer days off. I think that that's that's doable. Especially if you, like... If you sleep on time when you're supposed to on those days, I don't think it'll be that much of a problem. Uh, taking care of your sleep schedule will help you get through or at least be able to enjoy your weekends. Hello, Volcaos. How you doing? Welcome in. Welcome in. And uh, I'm glad that you started your new job and it went good. Awesome, man. I love it. Love to see it. Love to see it. Caught myself fidgeting with drumsticks often. Yeah, man, I, I, I fidget with everything. <laughs> um, hi, Demon Slayer. Welcome back. How are you doing? Hey, yo, is that the big boop? Is that the big boop? How you doing, boop? It's good to see you. Um, no sleep, never sleep, can't sleep. Oh, really? Is that so? I'm three weeks in my new job. It kicks my butt, but I'm happy with it. Hey, you know what? That's all that matters. If you're happy with it, then just keep going strong. And remember, guys, for you guys who work, um, this is something I have to remind myself. Um, <clears throat> listen, it's all about perspective. Think about more as, oh, I am, I, I get to work. Not that I have to work, but that I have this job. You have to remember that you used to pray to have a job, have this job. Remember when you would message people and you're like, hey, guys, can you like pray that I get this job? Like, I, I really need this job. Remember that. And also remember that you get to have this job. Not that you have to go to work. You get to go to work. And it changes a lot of your perspective. So just remember that. You're doing good just relax relaxing after supper. That's good. I, uh, what did I eat? Uh, I, oh, yeah, I had a tuna, tuna sand, sand, oh, my gosh. I had a tuna sandwich from uh, Jimmy Jones, from Jimmy Jones, um, and I had it sliced wheat. <laughs> you get the range tomorrow? Send him to the ranch. Send him to the ranch. See you later, platypus. Please, uh, a, pl a please elate you. What the heck? Appreciate you. 
<laughs> Ponderful Owl, how you doing? How you doing? I see you. Um, yummy, yummy, yummy yawns, yummy Johns. Apparently, I can't talk again. When can I ever speak? Right. <laughs> Uh, at least you remembered to eat this time. I, I, I have to. I have to eat. If I don't eat, I'll go absolutely nuts now. Like, I need to eat something. I can't work with the, on an empty stomach because before I know it, I'm going to have a caffeine headache and I'm going to cry. <laughs> uh, thank you for the hydrate unknown. Thank you. Um, Dern, you're late. Hello, Dern. <coughs> The cough has gone away, luckily. I have not been coughing. Um, I haven't really been sick since... I'm going to say Saturday now. Saturday. So I've been good. I It was really bad on Friday, though. On Friday, I was... Uh, on the morning time, I was wheezing. I was coughing so much. I was straight wheezing. <laughs> You're braving the hurricane that you saw? Oh, my gosh. I heard there was a second hurricane. What is called Milton? Is it true? It's a Category 4? Absolutely insane. Is there another one coming? Is it true? Is it true? Is it true? I saw it pop up on my uh, my Android. Is it category five? No way. I don't believe you. Hold on. No, you're you're lying. You're lying. You're lying. Hello, Fallen. How you doing? Oh my gosh, you haven't been here in a while, have you? Well, welcome in. It's good to see you back. And category five. Hey, no way. That's insane. So is everyone evacuating? When does chat ever lie? I, I mean, I'm just saying, category five is one 100. 185 miles per... Whoa. No way. No way. You're So you mean, is this one stronger than Helena? Hel Why do I keep wanting to call the hurricane Helena? Um... Oh my gosh. How did, how did I, how did I just forget it? Um, not Helena. Um... What, what, what is the name of it? Oh my gosh. It's, um, is it, you know, it is Helene. It is Helene. How do I pronounce it? I'm an idiot. Hi, Stone. How you doing? Um, I stumbled upon me. Oh, <laughs> um, I, well, I mean, I'm more wholesome than my chat is. That's for sure. They're mean to me. Uh, but also, uh, not Katrina. No, I'm talking about Helena or Helena. Helene, he Helen, 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 it's Helen, I'm sorry. Helen, Helena, Helena, it's Helena. Oh my gosh, okay, R anyway, is it worse than that one? Is this one, is this one gonna be worse, is what I'm asking. Just stop, <laughs> just tell it to stop, it legally can't destroy your house without consent. Stop. <laughs> also if there's only a category five said, listen i am glad i live in the midwest all right this is the one time that i'm gonna be like all right i'm ha i'm glad i got all that snow i'm glad i get all that snow but it's really sad i hope everyone can evacuate it's really scary i couldn't imagine thinking that one day i can have my whole home and then the next day it can just get wiped out and then also find out that the government broke and we get no money that, that that's insane i i could not could not you just pray that your aunt and uncle are safe yeah for real for real um i don't think i have any family up there right now right now at least because i i do have some family my aunt owns well she has like some sort of beach resort thing or something up there um she's not exactly my close aunt but i know she has a property up there somewhere so i i'm assuming I'm pretty sure it's like near Orlando. I just don't remember where she has it. Somewhere out there. I don't know where this one is hitting though. Where is Milton hitting? Do you know? I didn't really check into it. I was working earlier when I got the notification. Um, your friend Penelope is in the is in Florida and she had to leave Florida knowing that she had to head back to Connecticut. Oh my gosh, that's insane. Hello, Fee. Um, my favorite genre of music. Um Honestly, I, um, I like a lot of chill stuff. West Flo uh, r west coast of Florida. Oh, so it's in the Gulf, isn't it? It's hitting north of you. Oh, no way. Are you uh, evacuating, Bello? <clears throat> Glad to see that you're doing better. Clearly, you've had your morning kid. My morning kidney. My morning kidney. 
<laughs> Disney is still up and running. Listen, Disney would up would continue to be up and running if it was like the apocalypse. Like <laughs> they would still be up and running. <laughs> we could be overrun by zombies and Disney World is going to be like, "Yeah, well, we can huh? still keep going." <laughs> Uh, it also dosed and helped that the families affected were only given $750 each. Yeah, that's why I wanted to do a charity event for Asheville this week. But like I said, um, I have to talk to Compassion first and see what they got going on right now, uh, which is our sponsor, by the way, at the bottom. Uh, that's, that, th Compassion, every time I ever do any kind of charity event, it is always going to be through Compassion, almost 100% of the time. Uh, they're a trusted partner. I have worked with them. I have seen I have seen them actually do the physical work. I know people who work there. Um, and it's not even really work because, like I said, it's nonprofit. So I know the people at the church who, who do the organization for Compassion. Um, they work with our branch at the church. So um, I trust them. So I'm just waiting to see what they have going on right now with um, Asheville. But I know that they are planning to do some sort of um, some sort of um, like charity relief. But I just got to figure out when uh, when I can get that link. And then I thought I was going to have it this week. But even regardless, even if I did, I wouldn't have been, been able to this week. So I'm going to see what we can do next week. And if this hurricane is as bad as you guys are saying right now, there's a high chance that wherever it hits, we're going to still need to do some relief somewhere. So regardless, I do plan on being uh, semi-active with this community there. Um, I think that if... I'm not really going to say much about the 750 being loaned. Um, it's not my place right now. I'm not going to say anything. You already probably know what everyone is thinking. But I think that it's really important that we help out people who are in need. And we've done it before. We've done it for, with the kids before through, uh, through Compassion. I think we can also help out these um, these people who have lost everything. And if you guys know who Sassinator is, she's a close friend of mine. Uh, I met her in Orlando when we went to that convention, and um, she's been hit by this, by by everything that was going on. So uh, it kind of hits a little closer here because of that, and she has lost a lot. Um, she does, if you want to help her out, she did post her, her link on X. Um, I might just reshare it if you want, but I did share it. It's on my profile, so if you want to check my X profile, um, you can help them out there. And uh, she would really appreciate anything that she can get. So um, we will. We'll, I'm going to try and see what we can do uh, regarding Asheville and just regarding the um, the charities or just whatever they need help with right now. Um, like I said, I'm still getting information, so it's going to be give me a little bit of time. But <clears throat> but anyway, um, that's that's what we're looking for next week. You still call it Twitter? Yeah, I call it X, but I, it's because I used to call it Twitter so much. And everyone's like, you mean X? You mean X? And I'm just like, okay, whatever. Okay, X. <laughs> also, Joey, welcome to the meme champ. Did I just say that? I don't know if I did. Welcome to the meme champs. And Chris, welcome in. Welcome in. It's good to see you. And also, Blitzy, uh, it's good to see you. Um, good time zone, fella. Are we in the same time zone? <laughs> Don't call it zitter. That's gross. It sounds gross. But anyway, it's X, uh, Twitter, whatever you want to call it. Um, I did share it. You'll have to scroll down scroll down a little bit. But um, yeah, if you want to help her out, it would be greatly appreciated um, from everybody who deeply loves us, Sassinator. Um, so would you stop saying zitter? It's gross. Eastern time? Yes, yes. Um, I'm I'm not Eastern time. I'm Central time, but um, close enough, right? <laughs> it's nine o'clock for you. Yeah, no, it's uh, it's eight here, but close enough. Z Zitters it just sounds gross. It sounds like you're talking about a zit, and then you're like mixing it in with something else. <laughs> but yeah. Anyway, does that sound good? Do we have everything in a line for now? Um. But his Twitter zitter to send out the zeets. Ew! <laughs> Gross! I don't like that. The zeets, guys. Did you check out my new zeet? I love I love zeeting on zitter. <laughs> it's uh, Japan calls Twitter why? Really why? Why I meant hi Joey. Um, 
Yeah. <laughs> You're Christian. As a Christian, it's cool to, sh- uh, to see someone willingly share their faith online. We don't just do that either. We support a lot of the uh, not just charities, but we support Compassion International, if you want to check that out below. Uh, we try and sponsor kids individually to get them food, water, uh, deworm medication, whatever they might need. They might need. Um, in places like uh, Colombia or wherever, Chile, like there's a lot of different uh, areas in the world that there's kids that need to get sponsored. So we, uh, I do work very closely with Compassion International. So through them is what I do any kind of charity event through because, like I said, I trust them um, and I know them. So from there, I'm, like I said, I'm going to check out and see what they have going on uh, regarding <laughs> Asheville. I- because they sometimes help out on these type of relief situations as well. Would you stop, Shiro? Um, hi, how you doing, Brony? Welcome back. Welcome back. Um, and yeah, today we're just going to kind of... We're going to be a little chill today. I hope you don't mind. I, I really... As much as I would like to try and maybe drink an energy drink right now, I can't because I need to wake up at 5 tomorrow. So I can't exactly... I, I don't want to be restless all night by drinking caffeine. So um, it's going to be a little chill, if that's okay. And maybe possibly tomorrow it might be a little chill again, too. It really just depends. What am I doing out there? You could say uh, Celeste recommended me. Oh, <laughs> how you doing? Well, I love Celeste. She's awesome. I got to meet her in person as well, and she was a sweetheart. <laughs> But anyway, here we go. We're going to move to the Halo. It's something that I enjoy doing. I, I feel like on days that I like chilling, either A, I'm going to watch memes or not nah, even memes. Uh, I've been upset with a lot of the memes recently. They suck. Like, just in general, a lot of memes are just not good anymore. Wait, Boop! Boop, wait, hold on. I know, And I know you like drinking caffeine, Boop. Hold on. Wait a second. I got to show you something. All right, hold on. <laughs> I got to show him something. I don't know if I already showed you this or not. And I know everyone else is going to cringe at me. But hold on. I got I got a little something. I got a little something. Which one was it? Um, Oh, my gosh. Where is it? I got to look at my likes. You're ready to cringe. Shut up. It's no cringe here. All right? There's no cringe. Um... I don't remember. No, dang it. Never mind. I I don't I can't find it. <laughs> um it's here somewhere. You know, I'll I'll show you next time. Don't worry about it. All right, never mind. I was going to find it, but I can't find it right now. I would have to switch my account. Um have I tried Warhammer? No. My brother told me a long, 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 long time ago when I was like maybe 11 or 12. He said that if I ever played Warhammer that he disowned me as a sister. So it somehow stuck. And I just have not gone near it. I don't know what that's all about. I'll never forget that conversation. I bring it up and he's like, what are you talking about? I'm like, you literally said that to me. Just never let that go. No, I guess I didn't. I <laughs> Evade the game or what? Tabletop. Oh, he also said that about um, World of Warcraft. Uh, so your brother is a heretic. <laughs> Gonna be real. You weren't aware that there were any VTubers. I happen to believe in Christ. And that's pretty awesome. Um, there's a lot of them actually, Blitzy. It's just that a lot of... If people... Are, I mean, how do I put it? Um, when you're when you do what I do here, you got you got a role to play. You know what I mean? Does that make any sense? You're uh, you're making a character, <laughs> so it's a little different. But there's a lot of them. They just not all of them just put it out in words. <laughs> um, the video games are different from tabletop. Is it really? Is it really? See, I don't like tabletop games as much either. I, I Like I said, I have ADHD. I can't sit down for longer than... I mean, I'm surprised that I even sit here for streaming. But when I am, I'm constantly fidgeting. And I'm constantly looking around. Like, do me doing this and looking around all the time? I Like, this is... This is not exaggerated. Like, I do this all the time. Like, I'm constantly moving. Like, I just, I don't stop. (laughs) Like, when I'm at work, I constantly am moving. I don't sit there. I don't like sitting. Like, literally, they're like, you're giving me, you're giving me, like, what is the word they say? They're like, you're making me anxious. Sit down. And I'm like, I'm not going to sit down. 
I'm not gonna sit down. I can't. If I sit down and I feel tired, if even if I if I feel slightly tired, I get bothered. So what I typically do is I start exercising during my breaks, and then I'll like maybe do like some stretches. Um, but I'm constantly moving around. I'm hearing that you're an iPad baby. Heck no. Heck no. The, you know what I had? Naruto. <laughs> but um. But yeah. But yeah. Oh my gosh. Hold up, my tracking broke. Why does that happen? It's irritating me. Literally, everything is just breaking. That's great. So dumb. So dumb. All right, anyway. Yeah, like, everything breaks after a while, and I don't understand. I hate these programs. They're so stupid. Anyway. Anyway. Huh? Check my Snapchat. Why? Huh? Girl, why are you Snapchatting me in the middle of a stream? Huh? Okay, hold on. Oh, hey, you put up the neon sign! I love it! Huh? That's pretty cool. On air. That looks neat. Thank you for showing me. <laughs> Gotta put on those baby videos to keep you focused. Oh my gosh. Don't you jingle jingle at me, okay? You still use Snapchat? Not really. I only use it to talk to, like, close friends and relatives. You know, like I said, when Snapchat was really popular was when I was in school. So, it just is what it is. It was popular while I was in middle school, in, in fact. I had a lot of kids have it in middle school being nasty nasty, and they shouldn't have had it. They shouldn't have had it. <laughs> it makes sense that you can stream. Here is a constant blur of conversation, reaction. Listen, me talking to you guys is just... It's just talking to another... Another preschool. <laughs> You use Snapchat for one person now? Hey, it's Corky. Hello, Corky. Um, yeah, no, I use it for a few friends. Um, there's a few. I, I don't really, I don't really use it that much though. Like, I genuinely don't use it. I, I, let, let me put it this way: ever since I became a content creator, I have, I have distanced myself from a lot of anyone I knew in high school, anyone I knew just in general. I just, I kind of just. I'm doing my own thing, and I don't think anyone else has to be involved with it or know about it. And um, it's just I just kind of prefer it that way, <laughs> if that makes any sense. Also, Phantom Dragon, welcome in. How you doing? The only people who know what I do are pretty much everybody at my church, and that's it. And them, I'm close to. Anyone else that I know, ain't nobody else know about it. I don't, I don't go around talking to people about it. When people ask what I do, I pretend like I don't even stream. <laughs> I sh I mean, I, you're like my dirty little secret. I, well, I mean, no, actually, wait, that's a bad term to use. That doesn't even sound right. I, like, more like you're just... <laughs> okay. Well, more like you're just... Okay. Anyway, I was planning on doing a Halo stream, so we're going to do that, all right? Oh. I... <laughs> We're gonna we're gonna do that. Um and it's gonna be fun. And I'm gonna sit here and have fun. And <laughs> Um Yeah, so so yeah, this is that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> Gotta change your name. Don't <laughs> What are you talking about? You feel like you gotta go shower, you gotta do that anyway. You stink. You stink. <laughs> the relationship is moving a little. Would oh, you shut up? Oh my gosh! Don't be like that. I introduced myself IRL as Korean. Oh, I bet you do. I bet you do. I could never. I could never. Like I said, I I don't tell people what I do. If I do tell anybody what I do, I literally just tell them, oh yeah, I got a YouTube channel. <laughs> and I don't even. I don't even do anything on my YouTube. <laughs> and then when they ask about it, I'm like, oh, it's there. 
I, I don't even say Twitch. Sometimes I'll say Twitch. It just depends. But I never give anyone really information about me. I just don't feel comfortable about it. And also, they tend to look at me a little funny. Like, people in general. So I just kind of stopped doing that a while back. <laughs> Objectifying you? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I I would never. I would never. You introduce yourself as Larry Poppins. Oh, I bet you do. I bet you do. I yeah. I should just tell them I'm pro I'm a professional memer. But regardless, like I said, we do um, have his description. Can we take that? I, I just tell them I I just work at a preschool because I do. So I mean, and I work obviously here. Um, yeah, yeah. This is a preschool as well. So you know, I work at a double preschool. I'm just gonna tell them I work at two preschools. <laughs> There's a night shift one. They just don't know what it is. <laughs> <laughs> but it's pretty crazy. And we're the meme champs. The meme champs. <laughs> I edit videos for people. And let's see if they can catch on to the fact that that's my voice. <laughs> the preschoolers get a little quirky at night. It's the night shift. <laughs> they leave their kids overnight. It's like a boarding. It's like pet boarding, but with children. Pet boarding. <laughs> this is a post school. Yeah, you're right. That's what it is. It's it's night school. This is, this is night school with you guys. <laughs> you could say you work in radio. Hey, I mean, you know what? That's a that's an idea. That's an idea or a podcast. This is a podcast. You guys sit here and listen to these conversations. <laughs> that's called trafficking. No, it's not. No, it's not. Runs an underground toddler fighting ring. What in the world are you even getting at? <laughs> we used to let them wander around during the day. <laughs> there was the bite of 87. <laughs> Five nights at preschool. <laughs> now you're just being wild. Um, don't say it like that. People will get the wrong idea. Yeah, don't get the wrong idea or anything, Baka. You want to start a podcast? No, heck no. I would never do that. First rule of toddler fight club? <laughs> if it can crawl, it can brawl. That is the first rule. The first rule. <laughs> exactly. There we go. <laughs> um, <clears throat> always good to see you as well, David. And also Vice, welcome in. <clears throat> professional soon? How about no? How about professional memer? <clears throat> that works best for me. If it can crawl, it can brawl. That is, that's what we got going on. The baby brawlers. <laughs> there you go. Um, soon cast. That is the dumbest thing I've ever heard in my life. Tell me more. No, just kidding. <laughs> ah, you wish. Oh, I'm going to take advantage of the nap time soon. Yeah, go ahead. We got nap time in an hour. Go ahead. Take your nap. Hi, Soda Shine. Welcome back. It's good to see you again. Do you still do advice? I could use some after this week. What kind of advice are you looking for? What do you want to ask me? Listen, I'm not super wise, but I'll tell you what I can. I'd pay for that. To, you'd pay for that fight? You're right. I would, too. I want to watch a toddler brawl. I want to watch them fight. Fight it out. Not a death match. Just, just a regular fight. If I, <laughs> if I were to ask someone what they do and they give those weird answers you said, I would assume they do only fans. No! No! <laughs> <coughs> Oh, you know what? I've had that happen more than three times. On different occasions, I get it. <coughs> One of my coworkers was asking, "Oh, what do you do? Um, what do you do like for your hobbies?" And I'm like, "Oh, uh, I game and stuff." And she's like, "Oh, you, you do you make a living off of that?" I'm like, "Uh, I was like, no." I, I was being really evasive with the answers. <laughs> I was being really evasive with the answers, oh. and she gave me a really, like, a side-eye look, and she's like, mm. And I'm like, no, 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 that's not what I'm talking about. I don't do that. <laughs> and she's like, oh, okay. <laughs> and one time I used to say that I was an entertainer, like, two years ago, and I was such a freaking idiot <laughs> because I didn't realize the repercussions. <laughs> So I stopped saying that. I'm like, oh, I'm a content creator. I'm a content creator. And then I just stopped completely. And I'm like, yeah, I'm not telling nobody nothing anymore. I'm done. I, forget it. <laughs> not the entertainer. <laughs> but I am. But just not like that. I signed it. Did I sign an NDA? You know what? I, I'm making my own NDA. <laughs> uh, 
um, Wump practically is what they thought or something like that. I said, can you be a YouTuber? But I, I, I did. I did tell them I was that. But then they kept asking what my channel was. And then I kind of had to tell them. I was like, no, 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 no. Uh, <laughs> it all started the day I was born. <laughs> it all started when I was born. But anyway, uh, yeah, it, it, it's, it's kind of funny. I, I don't really tell people my business. Um, I, I don't find my life that important. I usually try and just tell... I, if I... If I make any connections with anybody out there, which, you know, typically I do, I, I talk less of me and just try to gauge on who they are. Um, I, just, I just rather not talk about myself in, in person. I, I've just I've been like that within the last like couple of years now. Um, but it's just it's just preferable to me. I, I don't I don't I don't like to tell them things. <laughs> not because I'm embarrassed Hello, or anything. This is the state police. The I police. heard from neighbors that you run an overnight preschool fight club. Yeah, I do. Can we investigate and ask no. more questions? No, you can't. It's not. It's not for you. You're not involved. Society makes almost anything sound right. Yeah, yeah, it does. And the sad thing is, like I said, if I tell people what I do, I'm like, oh, well, I do something online. Like, like Lexus said, they they automatically think I'm like talking about OnlyFans, and I'm just like, oh, just forget it. <laughs> just forget it. No. <laughs> It's your birthday today. Well, happy birthday, Ping. I don't know how old you are now, but happy blank, uh, blankieth birthday. <laughs> Unless you met us at a con, then you can't hide the fact that you're a streamer. Yeah, yeah. Well, if I met you at a con, I'd maybe hide my badge. <laughs> Not the only. Yeah, no. Yeah. <laughs> That's why. Just don't. It's just better that I don't say nothing. Say nothing at all. <laughs> Uh, but anyway, yeah, happy birthday, Ping. Um, keep it going. Happy another another year of you being alive. It's something to celebrate. Um, definitely can't hide your... Would you stop? Oh, my gosh. Let's Sammy! Do Sammy! No, 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 no. No. Don't do this to me today, okay, Sammy? My little professional lurker over here. Your only fan walking to the exit. <laughs> wow. <laughs> anyway, let's see if I can get this going now. Corey's Preschool Fight Club. Huh? If they can crawl, they can brawl. You're right. If they can crawl, it can Sign brawl. Sign your kids up today, and they will get the privilege of getting their teeth back at the end of the day. You're right. Well, maybe. That's a maybe still. That's a maybe. Maybe I'll give them their teeth back. Or maybe I'll just put it under their pillow and let the tooth fairy come and grab it. Which, a.k.a. is just a creepy guy. Um... Cryo! What in the world? What in the world are you doing, boy? You're no professional? What do you mean you're no professional? <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? Also, speaking of gifted subs, someone, I don't know who it is, but for the past two or three weeks, I have been getting random gifted anonymous sub uh, subs in the middle of the night or before streams. Um, Who the frick is it? And it's not like just like, whoa, five or six. It's like a handful and I need to, like, I don't know who it is, and I kind of don't even, I didn't even want to talk about it, because I figured if I talk about it, they'll keep doing it, but it, they're just not, they're not stopping. Yeah, it's not, it's like, before streams, or in the middle of the night, or a random part of the day, just random gifted subs, and I cannot find who it is, and I, and I didn't want to talk about it all this time, but I, I, I don't know who it is. I don't know who it is. What if I said it was me? D8, if it's you, I am going to actually throw hands. I'm not playing with you. Um, it's, it's, I don't understand, though. It's not me. I'm broke. <laughs> That's a mood. I'm broke, too. That's why I'd be working. <laughs> it's either Troon or D8. Yeah, it's definitely not Troon, okay? Troon is... Uh, <laughs> Troon is Troon. It's definitely not me. <laughs> You're like, it's definitely not. I still owe you pizza. Um, But, yeah, no. Tipping is better. No, I I just don't understand. It's driving me mad. I'm just like, who the heck? Who and someone did that again earlier today. I just why? Why? No laughing. No laughing? And you think that's a hard thing for me to do? You think that's a hard challenge for me? Alright, fine. Here. I'll I'll do as you say. Uh as soon as I can turn the timer on. Where is my timer? Huh. It got moved somehow. That's weird. Alright, anyway, there it is. 
Jingle, jingle. You're sad, poor, and pizza-less. That is not true. Are all of us getting pizza? I don't owe you pizza. I was talking to one person. Hi, Kazu. Welcome back. It's good to see you again. Uh, just watch people get hurt and she will laugh. Um, That's not true, okay? I'm not laughing at your misery. I'm laughing with your misery, okay? Um, You want some pizza? No, no. I don't want any pizza. I'm good. I'm... I am... <laughs> It wasn't that funny. It wasn't that funny. But anyway, pizza stream win. Never, 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 ever. Okay, did we figure out what we wanted to do for Friday? Um, did you say you wanted marbles? I can do that. I can do that. It just depends on you. But you have to remember, I'm gonna be playing. I'll be playing marbles for quite a bit of time, like a bit. So you just gotta just letting you know. Twilight Princess, it's a possibility. Pizza, m ew, no, I hate those. No, it's so I do nasty. Not. And don't, don't you ever say, say I, did. I did. Community arc. Um, hey, why would I do that if you don't even have it? Um, wasn't the th the thing teachers say if you bring something, bring enough for everybody? That yes. <laughs> It wasn't, it wasn't, I wasn't, I wasn't a laugh. It was more like a, it was more like a, ah, oh, ha, ha. Like, yeah, just responding. It, it wasn't that, you, oh, I remember, what the sigma. Uh, all right, listen, uh, whatever. It wasn't an actual laugh. It was just, it don't count. It don't count. It don't count. It do not count. It do not count. Okay, it do not count. You don't know me. You don't know me. You don't know me. The, the last toddler standing. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. It don't count. It don't count. You don't count. Spin the wheel. You know what? How about I? S mm. Hmm. <coughs> you can't make me do anything. You know, I, I make the rules, you know, and I could break it. I'm not Scamore! I am not, Don't you call me that. Don't you call me that. You don't know who... Listen, don't you call me that. You don't know me. You don't know me. What do you want? Oh, hello, Light. Welcome to the meme champs. Don't you say that. I'm not Scamore! You want to know... You want to know who the scammer is around huh? here? Huh? 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 It's what Asheville got. That's what scammed. Listen, don't start with me. Don't start with me. I'm not Scamore! It wasn't a laugh. My breath just escaped in rhythm. Yes, yes, thank you. Thank you. Hello, Guided Light. Welcome in. How are you doing? Welcome to the meme champs. Um, spin the wheel. Stop calling me Scamore! I'll, I'll, oh my gosh, fine, I'll spin it, you dummy. Give me a second. Whatever. You forgot I can lean in? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Let me get a closer look. Uh, uh, oh, yeah, that's pretty ugly. All right, give me a second. Let me go ahead and do it. What? What? Oh, I'm disappeared. You know why? Because I don't want to look at you. All right. Um, ew, back it up. You're acting like I'm trying to kiss you. Uh, what is that? Model constantly spinning. What? Spinning or something longer for... Satoshi, what is this? What is this? What does that even mean? What does that even mean? Excuse me? What, what does that even mean? Just spin. Just spin. I did! Okay, I'm gonna spin again. No, I don't want to spin again. No, 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 I did spin. Hi, Fall V. How you doing? It's good to see you again. Uh, uh, listen, you can't tell me to... S no, spin my... I don't want to spin the wheel. You just... Listen, whenever I do spin on something, you guys are like, Oh, no, you gotta do it, Scamori. And then the one time I'm like, No, I gotta do it now. You guys are like, No, spin. I... Oh... Oh, I spin. Oh, oh. <laughs> I get it. I understood. I know I get it. I, I was just saying in general. I, I was saying in general. Okay. <laughs> A woman moment. Shut up. I listen. I, I knew what I knew what you were talking about. I was just rephrasing. I I was saying what I was saying what you might have meant. Some of you might have meant that, and and that was referring to the ones that thought that. Is all. Get that thing off my head. All right, fine, fine, fine. 
Fine. Fine. Fine. I, like this. Like just spinning? Like this? Like spinning? What the heck? Why? Why? This is stupid! This is stupid! I don't want to do that! Whatever. Fine. Oh, wow! Look, legs! Oh, my gosh! Uh Stop saying we. I hate it. I'm not getting a timer! I'll do this for a few more minutes. I'm not doing this for five minutes! I am not doing this for five minutes! You gotta be out your mind! Not happening. I'll do this until I'm done. You hear me? Until I'm done. Now, what? this is a story all about how my life got flipped, oh, turned upside it. down, and Shut I'd up. like to take a minute Shut just up. sit right there. Shut I'll up. tell you how I became the prince of a town called Bel Air Shut in West up. Philadelphia, born and raised Shut on the up. playground, was where I spent most oh of my gosh. days chilling out, maxin', relaxin', all cool and all shootin'. Some b-ball outside so of the dumb. school when a couple of guys who were up to no good started making trouble in my neighborhood. I, I got in one so little much. fight in my... You're so stupid! Don't you Prince of Bel Air me! I'm not trying to do all that! <laughs> so stupid. Okay, how long are you gonna do this again? Five minutes! I'll do this until I'm done. Whatever. Oh, wow, confused college coming in here with a spinning polar bear. Pfft, whatever. Don't you have college work to get to? Don't you got college work to get to? Get rotated. I'm rotated. Wait. <laughs> Wait, that didn't sound right. I'm rotating. I'm rotate. I'm rotate. The fresh soon of Bel Air. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for that, little brat. <laughs> what did I come back to? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> uh, and the throwing knives. Shut up! You will not go near me with knives. Not even on your we wildest dreams. Oh, shut description. up! I still got one minute of this. I don't. I'm cutting it down to three minutes. Okay, three minutes. Three minutes only. 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 You see that washing machine? Point of view! You're stupid. You're stupid. Yeah, you missed, loser. Why don't you try and stop being a loser? Rotate. Rotato. Listen, I got one more minute of this. One more minute of this. And the punishment is done. The, the princess of Bel Air! Delete that clip! Delete that clip now! Whatever. I'm gonna hurl, too. Looking at you and your dumb, ugly face. That's what. Anyway. I'm rotisserie chicken. You know what? Shut up. Shut up. Alright, here we go. Spending like a ballerina. No, I ain't. No, I ain't! Point of view, you're a sock in a dryer! Shut up! You're so dumb! What made you this dumb?! Pathetic! You got one more minute of me. You got one more minute and we're done. Done, done, done. Because then if I don't do the, fi the full five minutes, you're going to be like, ah, you're, you're a scamory. 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 You're scamming us. You're scamming. Oh my gosh. I'm so done. I'm so done. Hurry up and turn 840. 840. Come on. 840. 840! 840! Oh my gosh, this is taking forever. 840. 840. I feel so stupid. And you look even stupider from this angle. I'm not going faster, no. Is your food done in the microwave? Shut up! My scroll finger hurts. Yeah, maybe a little bit. All right, I'm done. I'm done. This is the last. This is the last one. There we go. I'm done. Forty. Done. 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 Don't ask me to do stupid stuff like that again. You hear me? Remove that off the wheel. In fact, Satoshi. Remove it off the wheel. I'm not trying to do something like that again. It's dumb. It's pathetic. It's outlandish, and I don't like outlandish. I don't like outlandish. You might like outlandish, but no, I don't. I don't like outlandish. I think it's pathetic. Um, I'm not cooked. Don't start with me. 
Don't start with me. I'm in a bad looping mood. All right, here we go. Here we, no, I'm, we're not keeping it. I said no. I said no. I am the, I am the streamer here. I I decide what gets tossed and what doesn't. Okay. Check the pin. I ain't checking nothing. You're slanted. No, I'm not. I'm not slanted. I'm literally not slanted. I'm fine. And uh, hello. Um, I don't know how to say your name actually. But anyway, welcome in. Welcome to the meme champs. Um, major night. How did I make your night? I didn't do nothing. I didn't do nothing. Your eyebrows are slanted and angry. Don't even look at me. You're pathetic. All right. Am I ready to play? I am. Because you're wasting my time. Like always. Like always. You make me laugh. No, I didn't. I'm not. Are you trying to? I'm not. A, I'm not even. A, okay. Okay. Whatever. Anyway. Anyway. Are we moving on now? Or, or why? So why? Stop slapping me with cheese. You know what, Flaxerlint? Huh? You want to come in here and throw cheese at my face? Very mature. Very mature. I see how it is. Um. Anyway, like I was saying for the millionth time, uh, I am going to play some amazing uh, gameplay of me playing a game amazingly and stuff like that. You know what I mean? I suddenly, <laughs> I suddenly want to watch some memes, but I'm not going to because, well, I wasn't planning on it. I wasn't planning on watching memes. Hello, merchant. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? It's good to see you again. It's always a treat seeing you in. Um, don't see what could go wrong. I, I don't go wrong. Okay, I go right. I am always on the uh, correct side of everything. Of everything, of the mentality, of your um, on the right side of your uh, deathbed. Um, I'm always at uh, the right hand of. Uh, what do you mean lies? What do you mean lies? Today's Halo and chill, kinda. I, that's what I'm uh, hoping to do. Fudgeinator, what are you doing? Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm on the I'm on the right side. I I will see you take your last breath, your last dying breath. And I will lovingly say to you, you're pathetic for dying, for dying. But anyway, is it wrong then? You don't want to be right. Like, <laughs> huh? You know what? I mean, stink yeah, you're stinky. That is true. You smell like an air fryer. Uh, you're always trash my streams. You just put them on a monitor. Oh, yeah. So you're my professional lurker, are you? Lurking as always. I appreciate that. Have a good stream. You too, David. Enjoy the rest of your day. Um, and uh, yeah, no. <laughs> Spin. Have fun. Lord forbid a man bleeds out <laughs> on the pavement peacefully. Not when I'm around. Not when I'm around. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> <clears throat> what you do you not want to die with me near you huh you don't want me to be near you when you're dying but i'll make you i i i i will i will well you know i i would be good company i i would, I, I would be good company okay you don't you just don't know you haven't experienced it stay away from me <laughs> what? what 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 do you mean by this I would be great company, ain't that right, Aid Garden? You will make us, you will laugh at us. You're, you're trying to say that if you're bleeding, if you are bleeding on the pavement, you think I just laugh at you? Yeah. Well. <coughs> I would. You have no proof. You have no proof. Not even a little bit. I, I would. I. I, I I would I would be sad. I I would be sad. I would I would I would be sad if you died on the. <laughs> it's such a stupid example. It's such a stupid example. I wouldn't know what to do. I call the police. <laughs> what do you want me to do? CPR? And I'm not doing that. 
crap. I wouldn't do CPR on you even if you were dying. I'd, I'd, I'd hold your hand or something. I mean, not even that. Like, I wouldn't even do that. I'd just... I'd, yeah, you know, I'd, 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 I'd be around the block. I'd, I'd call help and... <sighs> I hope you die on a block. Shut up. I don't care. Die on a block then if you want to. I, I'm not going to be around. You know, call your mother or something. I, I'll, I'll take you to the emergency room. All right? Is that fine? <laughs> anyway. Are we going to play Halo or not? Um, Would you lick my... That is nasty. I Listen, I wasn't smiling. It's just the way things go when everything breaks, okay? It's not my fault. Don't even think of me like that. I, I hate when that happens. I'm about to just have an auto-delete. I don't even know what to do. <laughs> yeah, shut up. Okay, I you broke me. You broke me. It's because you're talking about you dying on the pavement. And it caused me to get all loopy in the brain, all right? prolonged eye contact. Yeah, well, it was a threat, okay? And you know what? I lied. It wasn't a threat. It was a promise. So watch your back. The stare? Not a thought behind those. Like, oh, thanks. Thanks. I, I You know, I, I, was, I was just genuinely thinking about Shakespeare. Um, you know, and some Mozart. I, I just, you know, there was just nothing but music. Fine-tuned music in my brain. That's it. Had to restart. <laughs> restart? Restart! Restart! Listen, I can't even hear how I sound right now. Shut up. Shut it! You ever try to talk and you can't hear nothing? Well, there you go. There you go. That happens a lot to me. Little Mac, welcome to the meme champs. How you doing? This thing needs to stop breaking. What are you doing? <coughs> what are you doing? Also, um, yoink. We're gonna move. We're moving on. Soon care. Yeah, well, you know what? Okay, listen, 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 carp boy. Don't, don't get me started. I'm, cause you don't want me to finish it. You've been scammed on what? What the heck did, <coughs> what did you get scammed on? I didn't even do anything. The wheel is spinning, but the hamster ain't running. Wow. You know what? You know what? Forget it. Get out of here. Get out of here. I hope you and your best friend have a lovely time. Um, sweating and crying and dying. Speaking of loading something, uh, did you know the little swirly thing in the corner of the game screen is called a, a, a what? What the frick is even that? I don't even want to say it. What does that even mean? You don't finish any- <coughs> What is that supposed to mean? Nice, take it back. Take what back? Alright, anyway. The wheel- What wheel? What wheel? There's no wheel. Oh, what? Are you making fun of me? Stop that. Stop. Stop. Whatever you redeemed is not gone through. 
whatever it was. <laughs> Can you spin again? I was entertained. No, I'm not spinning it. You're entertained. Okay. You're, uh, there's no helping you. I'm not spinning. Uh, anyway, we're going to move on to uh, some Halo. Is that great? Is that cool? Is that good? Well, it should be. Because that's what I feel like doing right now. And of course, I don't want to break. I want to break again. Because it seems like that happens quite often. I don't know what to do about that. What do you have to say now, huh, Kyokyo? Don't say anything stupid. Wait if you think about it, since Kaori is part phoenix, that means she has healing abilities in her tears and ah. her saliva. So if you're dying near her and she doesn't help you, it's because she doesn't want to not because she couldn't help. Why are you telling them my secrets? Huh? Haha, <laughs> I guess her name is Secrets. Oh, I get it. I guess her name is Secrets. Okay, I, you're an idiot. Okay, um... <clears throat> Let's move on. We're moving on. What am I thankful to God for today? <sighs> to be honest with you, I am glad I get to work. I can't give head pats. No, what? I don't want your head pats, even if you... Whatever. Hi, Black Panther. How you doing? Welcome back. I'm not angry. I'm not angry. When am I ever angry? I'm just a little loud and emotional. Uh, semi. I I'm, I'm expressive. Okay, I'm expressive. It's a difference. That doesn't mean I'm yelling at you. I'm not angry. I, I really, I, I'm not, I don't get angry the way you think I do. I'm just passionate. Not about you, but I'm passionate about the topic that I'm talking about. Anyway, hi, Slane. How you doing? And thank you for the hydrate. Appreciate it. Am I getting angry because I'm not getting head pats? No, I don't want your stinky, greasy, nasty hand near my head. Not at all. Mm, 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 mm. Not at all. I am not yelling at you. Listen, Aid Garden. There, I don't know what day it was, but you had me dying. I was crackling nonstop. What day was it? You were. I think I was playing Overwatch, and you were saying the stupidest, dumbest things. Um, you didn't say lobotomy core, but you reminded me of it. Uh, but you were saying the dumbest things. Now, every time I see your, your, your username, I'm like, great, what is he going to say now? <laughs> um, listen here. I'm, uh, I got a lot of passion. I got a lot of passion. I, I'm like a passion fruit. Uh, well, no, I'm not. That, that, well, no, because that's like romantic, and I'm not romantic. I'm more like, and, uh, you're an idiot. All right, um... Where should I move to? All right. Moving in. All right. Now we got some... Looks tasty, by the way. Wait, what, what looks tasty? <coughs> um, But do you have a lot of imagination? Uh, I have... I... um, Halo Infinite. I have... Um, I have... I I have thoughts in my head, I, but you know. Anyway, how you doing, Spartan? Welcome, man. It's good to see you again. <coughs> my nose is running. Sorry, I can't help it. It just gets a little. It gets a little runny at times. Um, oh my gosh, where is it? Where is it? Where's the stupid game at? Where is it? Listen, I gotta delete like half of these games. Where is it? Where is it? When did you move down there, stupid? Goodness gracious. Thank you, Aaron. I appreciate it. But anyway. Uh, <coughs> the one that says hello. Hello. Hello, hello. Don't know why I say goodbye. I say hello. Hello, hello. Wallpaper engine. I. Everyone uses wallpaper engine. Who doesn't? I remember using Wallpaper Engine back in, like, what, 2016? I used it before it became, like, the standard to have on everybody's PC. I'm, I'm not trying to say I'm like, like, oh, I was there before everybody else. But, like, you know, I, I use it. I use it a lot. I just, I, I'm immune to it. I'm immune. It's cool. It's cool. The wallpaper is pretty cool. Um... 
Why you got... Wow, you're funny. You think you're funny? Did you see that 343 Industries changed their name? Yeah, they called it Halo, right? Halo Studios or something? What did they call it? Halo Studios or... Uh, something like that? If I disconnect one more time, I'm going to lose my mind. I'm going to lose my mind. Okay. You're trying to redeem... <laughs> They're trying to redeem themselves so bad. Yeah, well... <laughs> yeah, they are. But you know what? I, I gotta say, um, 343 just had such a bad name to it at this point. It was probably a good business move to, uh, to re-change that. Or to rebrand their uh, company name, I guess. Whatever the heck they did. Um, it's probably for the greater good of the future of Halo. I don't know what they have planned in the future, but all I know is that it seemed like they were finally listening to um, the masses about what people wanted in Halo. I'm not a huge, huge, huge Halo fan anymore. I haven't been in years, um, but I still do enjoy playing online when I can. They also fired a lot of people. I bet they did, and they should. They should fire a lot of people. If they're not here enjoying Halo, then why are they working on it? That's just my opinion, though. Don't have to spread it around. Halo. More like, uh, uh J-Lo. Halo 3 was last good Halo. Um, Reach, Halo 3, and ODST were the best one or the last good ones. Same with Marvel. Oh my gosh, I can't watch a Marvel movie anymore. Hello, Fossa. Welcome to the meme champs. How you doing? Yeah, no, I cannot watch like a single Marvel movie. I just don't care anymore. It's run by Disney, and Disney annoys me, and they monopolize everything. I just don't. I, I have not enjoyed a superhero movie since Avengers. Uh, I just, I'm not. Not a single one. Not a single one. I don't care what came out. All I see is a, how can we make more money off of the American people? And they just throw out the same old stuff, the same old jokes, the same old, like, it's just the same exact content, basically, but just reskinned. I just, I'm not doing it. I don't just, whatever. I do not watch anything. Hot take, it peaked out Infinity War. That's not even a hot take. It's true. <laughs> um... You don't see Halo making a comeback? Honestly, I don't either, only because it's such... Halo is millennial core, okay? And that's the reason why I even go back to it to begin with. Um, it is straight, like, early 2000s uh, when everyone used to play. And <laughs> it's just... Yeah. <laughs> but, um, no, Halo is most likely never going to make a comeback again. And I love Halo, and I and I do enjoy it, but I don't think they can pull off another Halo 3-type experience. Um, I really don't. Unless Bungie, the original, yeah, if the original Bungie team was here, perhaps, perhaps. But even then, I highly doubt it. So it's for boomers now. I mean, let's be honest. Half the people who really, really, really enjoy uh, Halo, what are what what group are they? Millennials and boomers. <laughs> like it's that group. It's not. You don't really see a lot of Gen Z that enjoys Halo. Not very often. So I don't really see what in the world. I don't really see uh, Halo making a comeback. At least not a good one. What in the world is happening right now? Why is everything tweaking out? My light just turned off. I don't I hope a fuse didn't blow or something. And now my clock is flickering. Okay, is there like a is there like an exorcism I gotta do around here? What the heck? What is going on here? And And my KBS is dropping a little bit. Just a little bit. Want to check your box? I don't know. Uh, my clock is is twitching. Like like it's supposed to be showing the time, but it's flickering. Um, and my light turned off. One of my little leaf panels they turned off, and they're not turning back on. Uh, whatever. I'm too busy playing Halo multiplayer to deal with whatever is going on around me in my environment. <laughs> 
Oh, man. Too busy. Too busy. Hi, Trin. Welcome back. How you doing? Welcome in on a chill Monday where we chill and talk about Mondays. It's a Monday. All right, let's see. Let's get this. Um, put this thing over here. All right, what do you guys want? More sound from game or just low music and just chatting? What do you want? You choose the atmosphere. I'll just abide by it. Priorities, Halo. You want me to put low Halo sound and like medium music? What you want? Music? All right, gotcha. We're gonna chill and chat and play Halo. Sound good? So I'm gonna put this low. Oh, I'm dying already. Nice. All right, so let me put this low. Got some chill music. Um, and let's see if I can get my headphones working. Oh, that's weird. That's so weird. Hmm. It's not showing up. My headphones aren't showing up. Huh. Where is it? Hold on. Okay. You were just charged. What are you doing? Well, I mean, I have to hear the game at least. Uh, I don't see it. Improvise. I am. Did I set it to Wumbo? Nah, I didn't Wumbo. You Wumbo? She Wumbo? By the way, I have like three stacks of clothes to go through right now. I So I have a confession to make. I am very bad with keeping up with my clothes because I have so much right now. I, I threw a whole bunch in a bag to just give to uh, Goodwill. I have a lot of clothes I have to go through right now, and it's insane. I have three, I have three, like, not small tubs, like, three large tubs of full of clothes that I just washed. No, they're all clean. All my clothes is clean right now, but I have so much to go through, it's insane. Why is my... Oh, that's why. All right, here we go. Sorry, I wasn't even connected at all. Now I could hear it. Okay, I got it. Sorry about that. Yeah, no, I have like three bins. It's insane. Oh gosh, this is loud. Let me lower that. And, okay, that's not doing. And then, and put three. There we go. Now you could hear it. I feel like that's usually a common thing for people. I don't know. I mean, everyone I know, like, would do their laundry every waking moment of the day. So, like, I... I push off my laundry a lot. Like, a lot, a lot. And I just keep going through all my clothes until I'm at the last possible, like, pair of underwear. <laughs> and then I'm like, oh, I gotta, I gotta do that. <laughs> so, um... Yeah, I'm terrible with it. I'm terrible with it. <laughs> um. Oh, hold on. Let me move my thing. Let me move that right here. Yeah. We all been there? I hope so. Because I feel bad if not. Um, okay. Folding clothes is the worst chore. Yeah. No. For me, I have to hang it up. Like, hanging it up isn't so bad. It's just having to... You know, do all that. Yeah, I, I've been doing laundry for three days straight, so it's... Yeah, I've been doing clothes for like three days straight. I'm not even exaggerating. Um, it's just straight laundry. And then I'm cleaning all like the blankets I have because my dog is so stinky. How big is my closet? Not very big. And that's why I'm trying to get rid of everything. I'm trying to get rid of everything. Everything. Like, honestly, if I can just throw away all my clothes, I would, but it hurts me to try and do. Like, I want to just be the most, like, the biggest minimalist. It's, I can't help it. When I used to live with my parents, I had a bigger bedroom. And so now I don't, and I don't have a big closet space. So, 
I kind of have to get rid of like everything or put it all in boxes and I hate having to do it. I'm not a pack rat. Just burn it. I'm not a I'm not a pack rat. Hi Scotty, good to see you again. How was your Monday? Um Yeah, just it's a lot. Oh my gosh, how? <gasps> Salvation Army? Yeah, basically sending you a lot. I'm not a loot goblin. I just, I like my clothes. I still have clothes from middle school, okay? I do, but like they have memories. I don't know. Listen, I might be weird, but like, I feel like clothes hold, it holds memories for me. So I, I'm holding on to like my sixth grade band shirt and I wear it to bed. Like I, <laughs> like I don't want to just get rid of it. Does no one else do that? I'm not a hoarder. I just don't want to get rid. Oh, thanks. Thanks a lot, Spartan. Oh, 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 oh. Wow, wow. Can't can't have a stream with all that, right? <laughs> if you died, would you drop good loot? Heck, no. You'll get a lot of dirty clothes and um, um, maybe a leftover ramen pack. Sixth grade clothes? They don't fit you? Well, unfortunately, they fit me. <laughs> um. <laughs> so you remember your ex-boyfriend? Why are we talking about my ex? Why are we gonna why are we gonna talk about exes today? All my exes came from Texas. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I keep a lot of clothes that's like personal. I don't like to just throw away anything. I like to keep memory okay, listen, I'm a memory person. I like keeping things that have memories in them. I still have like notes I used to pass back and forth between me and like my crushes in high school. We would be flirting through freaking notes. Like I still have those. I have those and they're in my drawer. I, my mom, my mom was looking through them when I was moving out, uh, and that was a while ago. But like I, I was like, don't go through that. <laughs> yeah, it's sentimental. I, I hold on to things. I just I don't like to. It's almost you gotta let go. No. No, I, I I have it in a little chest and I keep it. It's nostalgic and it's funny to see how I used to talk. Like, literally, type like not typing but writing down XD in a little note. Yeah, that was that's crazy. I keep those. Oh man. Listen, I know a lot of people didn't like their high school experience. Um, personally, for me, it's a. Uh, it was sweet. I enjoyed it. It was all right. I mean, there's a lot of bad memories, but a lot of good ones too. You know, as long as you uh, get rid of your ex's hoodies. Um, you don't tell me what to do. <laughs> you have a drawer full of bracelets. Oh my gosh, I still have the I love boobies bracelets that they used to have out for breast cancer aware awareness. They were so popular in um, when I was in middle school. A whole bunch of kids would have them and pass them out like candy. And I, everyone, if you didn't wear them, you weren't cool. Like, it was so stupid. <sighs> but, like, we wore them. I wore them. And I also had a lot of band, band, um, I had a lot of band, um, bracelets as well. I had some from Sleeping with Sirens. Um, I had, uh, Pierce the Veil. What else? Did I? I had sleep. Oh, I had a Paramore. I had a Day to Remember, and that was my favorite one. I always wore the a Day to Remember, and yeah, I had silly bands, but those kind of got out of style real quick. High school was awesome. That's where you became a, a, ma a musician. Why? Um, the Wolf shirt. No, I didn't really wear a lot of that. Listen, I was a little cringy in middle school for sure. Everyone had a bad middle school experience from what I know, okay? Now, I don't think a single person ever went through middle school without having some sort of, like, horrific embarrassment or, like, hiccup. Um, yeah. No, I, ha I had my fair share of cringe in there. I'm not going to talk about it, but I had some cringe. And then middle school to high school. High school, I semi... I mean, I'll, I'll put it this way, all right? I wasn't, I wasn't afraid to show my personality. I was not afraid to show my personality. <laughs> no matter what it was. No matter what it was. You have your own what? Um, but, uh, but yeah, I used to, I used to do that a lot. 
Middle school is when you're, yeah. Yeah, no. No, when you're in middle school, I don't think any of them are aware of how cringe they are. And that's what makes it so awful. Because then when you go to high school, you're like, why did I do that? <laughs> For me, I, I, en I enjoyed, I enjoyed it, but what is your embrace thing? My embrace thing. What do you mean? Embrace thing? I was the type that made friends with all groups. Like, I, I mean, uh, we had cliques, you know, everyone would always have their clique. Like, you got the people who talked to only the band students. You got, like, the theater, the theater kids, the the ones that were in sports, you know. We had all those, but, like, I got along with everybody. I got along with pretty much everybody. I mo I had my, I would mo mostly be around a lot of band kids only because I was really big into anime. So they were the only ones that were um, more vocal about it. And um, that, was, that was pretty much where I mostly hung around. But I mostly, ke I kept seeking out all the anti-social people and forcing them to be my friend and listen to me yap. And, and I'm really not <laughs> exaggerating. Hey, Boop, are you still in here? Are you testament? <laughs> are you testament? <laughs> Boop, are you here? <sighs> uh, you were the cute emo girl? Yeah, right. You're funny. My first friend that I that I forced to be my friend, I thought was a drug dealer. <laughs> Everyone thought he was a stoner in middle school. <laughs> he looks like it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Did the same with you, Shane? What do you mean by that? What do you know by that? I was a yapper, yes. And I always made friends with all the anti-socials because... They felt comfortable around me, and I felt comfortable around the quiet ones for some reason. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't like when someone outmatched my yap, I guess. <laughs> we don't challenge me. But the friends we made along the way. I was obsessed with anime at a certain time. I did not play Magic or Yu-Gi-Oh! I actually hated that, and I still do. You just talk to whoever, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Would I say I was popular? No, they knew me since like elementary school, so I would say that I was very well known. But no, I didn't go around trying to befriend everybody like that. I didn't care that much. I cared about my hobbies and yeah, I cared about my hobbies more than trying to make people like me. Let's put it this way. At least I was real to what I was, even if it was cringe. And I was always making the teachers laugh and always saying some stupid crap. I wasn't really the... I mean, I wasn't... In some classes, I was considered the class clown because I just kept saying something dumb. I, I always had a comment. And I knew exactly how to make the teachers laugh every time. I always knew how to make the teachers laugh. It, was, it wasn't hard to do. It really was not hard to do. Some teachers were harder than others. But a lot of the female teachers, like my Spanish teacher, I remember, it was so easy to make her laugh with the dumbest things. I, I literally would just say a meme and or I'll show her a meme on my phone and she and I would make a I would make a meme based off of the class and she'd be done. It was just a stupid little meme. It really was not hard to make them laugh, though. Did I say believe it out loud? No, I did not. Well, at least not in public. <laughs> Yeah, no, not like that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I've been in the same area for a long time, so uh, in that area that I was at, everyone pretty much knew me because I was, I knew the elementary schools. And it was a decently big high school. Did I ever Naruto run? I am actually proud to say that I did not do that, but I did do it when I was like maybe 13 and I was in middle school and I don't think I ever did that in public though. Yeah, I would not do that. I, th oh, you know what? I didn't do it. And I remember why now, because there was this kid who was really big into Pokemon and, and I hate to say this, but obviously we were all immature. 
um, in middle school. But there was this kid, and he was he was very into anime and Naruto and stuff like that. But I didn't really like him. It's the same person that squished my finger in the corner of a doorway. Remember when I said it was on accident, but I was, like, so mad? Well, basically, I didn't like him because of that. Because uh, he almost broke my finger. But he would Naruto run, and I, I felt embarrassed to be in the same room with him. And I was just a mean kid, unfortunately. Um, so I was just like, yeah, get away from me. So I did not Naruto run, because I already saw how angry that kid made me. And I just would not... I Yeah. So I'm glad to say I was not that. <laughs> But yeah, it's a real community. We just chill. <laughs> Wolf run. Listen, listen. Okay, I, I I got another confession. Um, I used to play these online multiplayer games, but they were just like Wolf RP stuff. It was literally, well, you know what I'm talking about, because I showed you guys and you all laughed at me. But I used to play that game, and so they basically, I would basically have like my own wolf character. <laughs> and like make a like make a script and paragraph about about it. Yeah, whatever. Whatever. That was like 13, 14 when I was 13 or 14. I was still in middle school. Miguel. Uh, where is he at? He was shooting me. Dang it. <laughs> but it was something. It was something. On all levels, it's not physical. I am over. No, uh, yeah, I I did re very much enjoy wolves. I don't remember why. I think because I got into wolf's rain, and I really liked the wolf. I don't remember what got me into the to the actual. Like I don't know what ma made that my favorite at the time. Um. But yeah, I feel like everybody has had a, an experience of just intro like really liking wolves. Okay, don't deny it. Hi, Vivid Dreams. I haven't seen you in a hot minute. What's going on? What's going on with you? Yeah, in high school, I stopped caring completely about what people thought. Five minutes remaining. You're late for class, are you? That's it. To the principal's office. To the principal's office. <laughs> Welcome back. But yeah, no, um... Honestly... I think what I miss most about high school was, um... One... The, uh, I, I regret not making as many connections, maybe. I was very selective with my friends back then, and I'm still selective now. But I regret not, um, making more, more connections. I feel like I could've, and I was definitely able to. I just, again, I was just picky. I think, I think it's fine to be picky, but I w it would have been nice to have more. I, I enjoyed hanging out with people. I think it would have been nice to hang out with more than the same five people that I would be around a lot. And I only am still friends with like maybe one or two of them to this day. So I don't know. Twilight Princess is cool. Yeah. I, actually, you know what? Twilight Princess might be what got me, like, uh, interested in wolves because I I played that very early on, and I was really much enjoying it. It was the first time I ever wanted a poster or something. So, yeah, it might be that. The right amount of people my way? Well, now there's too many of you. <laughs> uh, it's your favorite Zelda, is it? Yeah, it was mine too. Did I ever get that poster? No, actually. I did not. I was looking in FYE and stuff and like stores like that. Um, they weren't... Back then, pop culture, video games and things like that was not as popular. So it was harder for me to find like things like that unless it was on eBay. <laughs> what about Twilight Sparkle? What in the world? No, I definitely... I never got into that. I never got into My Little Pony because I cringed when middle school about it. Well, let me know how you really feel. What are you talking about? What'd I say? <laughs> In kindergarten, you wanted to be a velociraptor. In kindergarten, I wanted... What did I want? Mm. When I was little... I wanted to be a veterinarian. That's what I wanted. 
And then I realized if I'm going to do that, I might as well be a, like go into medical <laughs> because the same amount of medical school that you would need, you'd get paid more. You get paid more for working on humans than you would with animals. So I dropped it. <laughs> But that was in high school. I, I was taking biology courses and, um, like, B, uh, what's it called? AP classes. And then I'm like, you know what? There's no point. <laughs> and I hated biology. Uh, biology 2 sucked. <laughs> but anyway. I've always loved music, too. But I, I never, I don't think I've ever, I never loved it enough to put in the effort. Until now. Now I put in the effort. Every girl's the same type of career path. And every guy's the same type of career path. I want to go into sports. I want to be a video game developer. How does that sound familiar? I want to I wanna make video games. I want to be a programmer. Don't start with me. Don't start with me. Lies. Am I wrong? Am I wrong? Uh, <laughs> military? Yeah, didn't even say that one. <laughs> I go to the military. <laughs> you feel offended? <laughs> uh, hey, at least I didn't want to go and be a nurse, okay? Like everyone else in my family did. Everyone else in my family went into like the health industry. I That was like the least of my wants. Gosh dang it. You wanted to be a welder? Really? That's different. Why am I attacking you like that? <laughs> Cause y'all started it! You guys started it! Don't start with me! Why does every girl choose the same career path? Okay, okay, you wanna be generalized? <laughs> It's gonna be like freaking. Oh, Come shit. on. Come on. Thank key. you for the hydrate. I'll do that in just a second, Lunar. Also, welcome in. Where are they? Where are they? You're playing Tax Slayer? I love sl <laughs> Tactical Pepper. Yeah, I love playing Slayer. It's my favorite. It's the most satisfying for me when I wanna just chill. Or. Yeah, just chill and just have fun. The military is the male version of medical school, okay? <laughs> Listen, the I I love battle medics. I love them. I don't know why. I just do. I love them. Love them. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> who the heck is shooting me? <laughs> uh, move around over and over again, and it'll be harder to find me. Where are they at? There you are. Gotcha. Dang it! <laughs> Got my killing spree, did they? Um, yeah, you love the medics too? Me too, me too. You glad you ain't a battle medic? Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Listen, I don't- I hate the medical field here, okay? Here. Here I do, okay? I have never been treated so much like dirt like I have been anytime I just go to a, a regular doctor's office. <laughs> like, a nobody love their job working in this industry and no one enjoys going in either. That's why I don't even like going in. I just don't enjoy it. I, I don't care. Like, you know what? Like, I know the ultimate healer. I don't need to go, you. Forget it. Forget it. Y'all gonna treat me like crap. You should be like, crap. Is there something wrong with it? <clears throat> I'll get to you in a second. I'm like, okay. All right. <laughs> All right. Sorry that I have a problem and I have to bring it to you. Who went into the industry. You're the one who wanted to do this career. Anyway. I don't know. I've never, I've never, I have never really gone to a doctor's office and I feel like I've never been treated well. And they always like, it's like they know that I don't know stuff. So they're just like, they know how to take advantage of that. I don't know. I don't like the medical industry. I really don't. <laughs> Jesus got the best customer service. <laughs> 
I love that. That should be a shirt. That should be a shirt. I want it. I want it. <laughs> oh, I just made two people rage quit. That's great. That's hilarious. Why are people rage quitting on SWAT? Calm down. It's just a game. I love seeing the little comments fly over here. It's just SWAT. Cameron will be still trying to argue. That's another thing. Anytime I ever go to a medical branch, I kind of understand why they're so crabby. Because there is a crap ton of people who are just so awful. Like, they're just so awful. They come in and they're just like, mm -hmm. I've been sitting here for 45 minutes. You're gonna deal with me. No. Th why doesn't my insurance pay for this? Like, oh my gosh. Uh, they'll take it up on the phone or something. <laughs> they ain't gonna do nothing for you. It is just the US. Yes, it is. It really is. Oh, I got him. I'm at 20 to 4. People are human too. They are. Absolutely. They are. But I just could not work in that industry. <laughs> not getting up. It's internet issues. Oh, it could be internet issues. You're right. That is true, Lunar. Also, I didn't get to hydrate still. Sorry. Oh, great. But yeah. What were, you, what were you trying to do a slide for? What were you sliding for, boy? What were you sliding for? <laughs> sliding for your death is what you were sliding for. Um, and Karen would still try to argue. Yeah. I, I'm gonna hydrate, don't you worry. I'm... Oh, here we go. Let's do that. Let this mat battle end already. Oh my goodness. All right, you're dead. All right, we win. I got 23 to four. We got, all right, my goodness. All right, get my hydrate, thank you. Um, you have, I have a splinter. <laughs> I like hydrating. Oh crap, I'm drinking an energy, oh! I forgot. Th okay, I have an energy. I'm drinking G Fuel right now, and I didn't realize it, it's it's literally blue. It's literally blue, so I thought it was water. My my brain is so used to drinking G Fuel. I gotta wake up at five in the morning for work. I'm an idiot. I'm literally an idiot. What in the world? I'm gonna be stuck up now. I'm wondering why I have more energy than usual right now. I'm like, ah, oh, I feel a little bit more energized than usual. Uh, well, because I'm drinking freaking G Fuel. You know what? Yeah, we're sponsored by G Fuel. Get some G Fuel using my code, code Lupin. You want to stay up with me until 5 a.m.? You should. Go on. You want to ruin your sleep schedule? Go ahead and do so. With me. With me. Or drink it in the morning for even more energy. In the morning. Because you stayed up all night. <laughs> oh, welcome in. Welcome in. It's the Fallout flavor. Actually, I am drinking the Fallout flavor. You're right. How did you know, Jordan? I literally am drinking the quantum. How did you know that? That's a little weird. I'm a little freaked out now. How did you know that? How did you know that? We're sponsored by Bean Fuel. <laughs> the beans. Gonna be hopping off the walls? Nah, I mean, I'm used to it. I think my body... You said it's blue. Oh, well, yeah, I did, but it could have been like... It could have been sour chug jug. You didn't know. It could have been sour chug jug or anything else. <laughs> if my water is blue, contact professional. <laughs> you know, well, my brain just associated water, okay? Rug, chug, jug. <laughs> Can't handle my caffeine. Can't handle my freak. No, I'm just kidding. He's in your walls. Is he, though? Handling my uh, crazy caffeinated butt. My eyes are watering. Chug sploosh. You just guessed. Lies. You knew. You saw it. You saw it through the screen. See you later, Lunar. Appreciate it. Have a good one. Make a, a back rooms carpet flavor. Ugh. Not the back rooms. If your brain associates blue with water, 
contact a medic. Why are you saying that? <laughs> You're funny. You're funny. It's water. I think of really chill glacier water. I think of glacier water. Why in the world? Uh, let's see. The reason why they don't do that, Blackjack, is because a lot of people here do not drink degenerate stuff. <laughs> That's why. Some people have taste. Oh my gosh. What in the world? Got him. Dev, was that you? Dev, was that you? Dev, was that you? Did I just triple kill and Dev, was that you? Was that you, Dev? Did I just... Did, are you playing on the opposite team? Ain't no way. Dev, that's you! You're on, I'm playing you, bro! Don't you stream snipe me. I'm gonna get mad. Don't you stream snipe me. That was you, Dev! What are you doing in here? You're on the opposite team. I just killed you. Um... Oh gosh. Oh, gosh. That's crazy. Crazy. Alright, don't be stream sniping me, you hear me? Don't be brat. Don't be a brat. If you're gonna be in this game, don't stream snipe me. Oh gosh, someone left. Who left? Run. Oh gosh. Dang it, PNW. Is he actually in the lobby? He is. He is in the lobby. He's over there. You see him? He's on the bottom. All right, let's see. Um, I probably should be looking at my radar now, shouldn't I? Gotcha, Dev. Gotcha, Dev. No, I can't be lacking. I don't want to be lacking. Everyone cheer for Dev. Why are you cheering for Dev? For what? Okay. Why are you all cheering for Dev and not me, huh? Jerks. Jerks. Gosh. Okay. A good underdog moment. Oh, great. I'm getting doubled. Ugh. Listen here, buddy old pal. Don't start with me. Now I'm being... Everyone's voting for... Voting for Dev instead of me. I was supposed to be your strimmer. And you don't even care. Y'all jerks. That's what. Oh, I just threw that at me, didn't I? I did. Oopsie. Oopsie. Now I don't want to... I'm not getting killed, but I don't want to get killed by Dev once now at this point. I don't want to get killed by Dev once. I'm going to get bothered. So I'm going to try hard. I'm going to get really upset. <laughs> I'm gonna be like, no! You will not kill me! Forget it! No shot. Okay, ain't happening with me. Ain't happening with me. Ain't happening with me. You're not gonna get me once. You're not gonna lay a scratch on me! Not a scratch! Not a bullet! Not a singular bullet. Go, Dev, go? No. I've already killed him twice. He's stream sniping me. I know he will. Gotcha! 
I'm on a killing spree. Come get me. Come match me. Come match my freak. Come back out here, freak. Yeah, everyone's saying dev so many times. It's useless. Oh gosh, I'm out of weapons! I'm out of what? How am I out of weapons? I'm literally out! I'm out of my stupid weapon! That's crazy. Why? Uh-uh. Alright. Oh, I just killed myself. You know what? Better me than anyone else. Oh my gosh! I just committed suicide! And Dev took it because he was shooting at me. Bro! That doesn't count. Gotcha. Got my kill back. Got my kill back. It don't count. I just got him back. Gonna match my freak? Listen, match me. I'm carrying my team like always. I'm actually kind of tryharding because I don't want y'all be like, ha ha, I dev one. Ha ha. No, he didn't. This team is not going to lose. I'm going to get very bothered. I'm going to get very bothered. I'm going to get very bothered. All right, let's see where we at. Where are you going here? Come on. Yeah, I'm actually trying. Yes, I am. For once. Fully locked in. Yes, I am. <laughs> of course. Not happening. Uh-uh. Where are we going, huh? Where are we going? Crap. Gosh dang it. Lugwigs. How is my team losing? How is my team losing right now? Come on. Dev, yeah, I got five to eight. And those deaths are by me. We are not going to lose because my team is being doo-doo caca. My team is very much throwing. Because the other team has dev. Get out of here. I'm actually trying to win this. Yes. I'm trying to carry my team to victory. My team is so bad. gracious my team sucks man why do they suck so bad why do they suck what in the world hi <laughs> sorry dev you were low why does my team suck De dev is on the freaking winning team literally I'm literally just trying to get this team to not, like, lose. And they keep dying. They keep dying. How do they keep dying? Oh my gosh. They keep dying. Has anyone told them to just stop dying or not? Sorry, Dev. <laughs> uh, they won't stop dying. I'm trying to carry this team. I really am. How are you dying to these people? How? Just how? This guy didn't even turn around. Please let us win. I'll win. I'll, I gotta make this. I gotta make us win. I gotta make us win. My team just needs to stop dying. Please. Please let my team stop dying. Please. Please stop dying. I want to win. I've never wanted to win a game so much on Halo. This is the one game I want to win. Let them stop dying for three seconds. Please. Please. For three seconds. 
Yes, they are. Please, please. Oh my gosh. Please. I got 20 kills and seven deaths. I'm done. And five assists. Listen, I'm angry. I tried. One person on my team got zero kills and 18 deaths. 18 deaths. Who the freak got 18 deaths and zero kills? Who was that? No, no, no. Run that back. Who was that? Who was that? Everyone report this guy right now. No, no. 18 deaths? 18 deaths? Look at this. Look at this guy. This guy. Where is he at? Right here. Where is he at? Where was it at? He was literally feeding. Yes, he was. Right here. 18 deaths. 18 deaths. Zero kills. What in the world is this? What is this? Dev, you did... All right. I got the better KDA. I got 14.7. I had the best KDA here. <laughs> the other team was eating good from one person. One person. This guy literally was like, oh, oh, does Lupin want to win this match? Let me die 18 times. Zero kills. Here, Dev. I got a 42% accuracy. Listen, I tried. I tried. I don't care. I tried. I could not carry this team with this guy dying every five seconds. Could not. <laughs> oh my gosh. It was Dev's second Xbox. <laughs> I laughed at him bleeding or something. Yeah, something happened. He won for the mods. Yeah, well, he didn't win. He won he lost every 1v1. <laughs> Sorry. Try again. Spin the wheel since Dev won. I'm not spinning no wheel. And Dev didn't win, just so you know. If you're talking 1v1s, I won. By a lot. By a long shot. <laughs> a win is not a win. Not in my book. Not in my book. Thank you, Trone. <laughs> my gosh. Lost the fight, but won the war. <laughs> <coughs> My nose is getting there again. Excuse me. No, I did not lose. My one teammate. My one teammate. The loser. The world's biggest loser. Running a bowl. I don't care what your poll is. I ain't doing it. <laughs> nope. Nope. Anyway. Me on Apex. <laughs> the you're is that the best the best player on Halo for real was that guy on my team. <laughs> uh strongest strongest player on Halo. Strongest. Let's see. Okay. Now I don't care. Now I'm back to my chill. I'm back to my chill. I don't want to have to try hard again. I want to just play. I just want to play. Have some fun. All right. What are we doing? Forbidden? <coughs> Burp. What made me go try hard? Because Dev was on the other team. Because Dev was on the other team and I didn't want him to get a victory over me. I don't let no one from my mod team try to stand me up. No one can stand me up. In anything. In anything. I'm competitive, Lupin. The, enemy VIP. the VIP. Man, I hate VIP. What if Dev was on my team and had more kills? He wouldn't. And he didn't. Gosh. All these grenades. All these grenades! Move out the way. Move out the way. We're gonna parkour on Halo. Parkour! Like when Ben got what? When he got what now? Oh gosh.
trying to get him, but he. Come back here. Dang it. I tried to flush him out. Got him. Got him. All right. Got their VIP. Now where? Hell of a job, Spartan. Oh. Hi, Ping. Welcome back. Hello, Armored. How you doing? How you doing? We are Armored. I don't want to be VIP, though. Don't make me the VIP, please. I beg of you. What are you doing here, huh? 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 Oh. 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 Wow. Me with the pistol on the main character? Yes. Yes, I am. I'm the VIP. Oh, great. Where's my teammates? I'm gonna need some team. Oh, gosh! Right by the enemy team! <laughs> they spot me right next to them. Oh, gosh. Oh, great. Why wow, they gotta spawn me right there? You're doing really good today? Oh, great. Oh, great. 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 Somehow I'm still alive. I want to continue to be alive so I can win this points for my teams. Gonna keep going. Oh gosh. I'm trying to be elusive. And I think it's working. It's working. I don't know this map very well either. I guess I'm gonna go by Assassin. Protect me, Assassin! Protect me, Assassin! Psych, you thought I was gonna be next to, next to him? Ha! Huh? Jokes. Jokes. Jokes on you. Jokes on you. Jokes on you! Oh! He tried to snipe me. He tried to snipe me. Woo! Oh gosh. I went right next to my enemy team. Oh, I killed him too! Regardless, I won some points. Quite a bit of it, actually. New VIP. Uh. All right. They're not coming after me. Oh, great. Great. Assassin is the kitten. There's the VIP. Oh, no. Not him. Not him. Not him. Not him. All right, let's see. Oh, gosh. Oh, I'm VIP now, huh? Got him. Oh, gosh. Who took that kill from me, idiot? You're supposed to let me get it. You're supposed to let me get it. Why are you taking those kills? Are you dumb? Do you not know how this works? VIP. Oh, we got a new VIP for some reason. I'm not the VIP anymore. <laughs> we traded. Boy, oh boy. All right, let's see if I can get this. Thank you for the lurk, Sonic. I appreciate it. It's just a chill day today. I always appreciate you just hanging around. Frank Ryder just got killed. I just killed myself. That's all right. At least I wasn't a VIP. <laughs> I thought there was a platform down there. I was wrong. You like how today is? Really? I'm surprised. I am surprised. Oh, great. Give me that. 
It is definitely chill. Gosh. New VIP. Gosh. Right, it's, it's not like I'm going to be good with this anyway. Aha! Got him. Mm. Oh, crap. I'm VIP now. Oh, crap. Just talking and watching me play Halo, huh? Ah, oh, frick, man. I missed. That's because I tried to go for that headshot. I should have just done the whole snipe and hit. Great. Oh, well. Uh, I'm the VIP again? Why? Why? That's fine. I guess I'll take it. They're all aiming at me. Got him. VIP versus VIP? Let's go. Ah, he was behind me. Rivers flowing you. That's okay. VIP didn't kill me, so that didn't matter. The VIP kills? That's a problem. Stop making me VIP. Okay, that's not me. Yeah, it's called no scope. Okay. Gonna move away from there. Don't need to get them that kill. This is how you play Halo. Don't die. Got him. My revenge plan. Gotcha. Oh boy. Where is he down there? Oh, throwing grenades, are we? Well, you're dead. Um. Gotcha. No! Why would you? Oh, you were the VIP. Good. Never mind. I'm sorry. <laughs> My bad. That was a good teamwork then. Why are you killing me? Am I even VIP? Anyway. Anyway. Oh boy. Get him. Ah, oh, oh, what the fudge? I hate everything about me right now. Oh my gosh. So stupid. Who the heck? What? Who's shooting at me? Don't make me the VIP right now. Why am I getting teamed by two of them? Oh my gosh. So annoying. Oh well. Where are we at? Where we is. Where we is. I don't, I hope not. Oh boy. Friend forced you to play infinite? Is he even a good friend? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> nice. Are you teabagging? He is. <laughs> friend, uh, yeah, I like infinite. I'm, I don't have a problem with it. It's fun. Although, I want to get better at snipes. I just don't really play snipe very much. But I practice when I can. On here. By playing. It. Alright, here we go. Closing out. Yeah, I didn't do as good as I thought it was. Nor. Get me out of this. Get me out of this rank, please. I beg of you. The game. Ugh. I hate when the game glitches like that. 
Got to relaunch it. It's a what? Decent Halo game? It's all right. Anything funny happened today with the kiddos? Um, hmm, not that I can think of today. It was pretty, it was really tame today on a Monday. Mondays are tame. It's not crazy. Kids also feel that it's Monday, so typically they uh, behave. Gotta do it again. My nose is running again. Do I have a favorite food? Um, uh, honestly, yeah, it's still masa chili. I was trying to think of what it might be if it changed, but it has not changed. I love pasta. I'm a pasta eating girl, but I don't really eat a lot of pasta because it's just really high and just too much crap. So I don't really eat a lot of pasta anymore, but it's my favorite. It's my weakness, I can assure you. Any type, any type of noodles, okay? I'm a fan of all noodles. I'm a noodle lover. A big old noodle lover. That has not changed. Let's see. This game's taking forever. Pasta is good but unhealthy. Yeah, incredibly. Techno. I mean, that's kind of all we're playing right now. <laughs> Nothing is impossible. Wow. I am a noodle lubber. I love hot chips, yes, but it's not my favorite. Grab a bowl. Maybe. Maybe. Jails? Jails. Yeah, mac and cheese is nice. I like mac and cheese a lot, but I prefer like Italian dishes over that. Um, and I also really like ramen, but any kind of noodles are good. And I'm not just talking about regular ramen. I'm talking about like actual good. Like anytime I go to a, um, anytime I go to like a Japanese steakhouse or things like that, I don't even end up getting like the steak. I always end up getting the ramen. <laughs> a hibachi grill nah ramen grill how about that authentic i just want yeah authentic i don't like i don't <laughs> i'm not trying to eat no top noodle <laughs> there's a conveyor belt place you know really i know a few out in chicago you could do ramen but instant ramen is kind of mid it's not even just mid it's disgusting and bad and terrible and high in, in sodium and just absolutely horrid just no one should ever be forced to eat that garbage <laughs> well i feel bad for the college students eating them top noodles it sucks there's a few rarities in the burb yeah no, I don't know that one. It's instant. It is instant. <clears throat> You're not supposed to microwave. I don't care. Everyone microwaves instant ramen anyway. <laughs> I don't really eat that anyway, so it don't matter. You had boiled potatoes. Music's top tier. Glad you like it. Also, welcome back, Dudax. Good to see you again. Don't look at ramen noodles under microscope. Yeah, because there's like little micro like nasty things on it it's nasty it's gross it's really gross you you always could mm. see you later thank you for coming in freedom have a good night good to see you too dudex it's a happy monday it's a quiet monday today is a chill monday so there's not a lot going on but i do love chatting so we're chatting you're going to Japan next year? No way. Yeah, brag to me. Go ahead. Then why is it on the ramen? Yeah, there's like little micro like parasites on that top noodle. It's so gross. It's so gross. It's so nasty. Good night. He won't come out. 
It tastes it makes it taste better. No, it doesn't. That's nasty. Make those bullets sing, Spartan. Gross. Have fun in Japan though. Hey, has anyone been watching any new anime recently that they can recommend? I've been looking for something to watch on Crunchyroll and uh, I'm very picky, but like I'm so picky to the point where I can't even I, I will pass up a good anime because I'm just like mm. Like, you know, the whole don't judge a book by its cover. Well, I unfortunately judge the entire anime by just a sentence <laughs> and, and the cover. Elusive, elusive what? Sorry, hold on. I, I was busy focusing for a second. Elusive samurai? Hmm. What's it about? Samurais? <laughs> uh, yeah. And everyone wonders how I kept beating Kaito and SWAT. Did I finish Spice and Wolf? Yeah, a long time ago. A long time ago. The remake, right? Yeah, I finished that. You've lost a teammate. Um, I'm the kind of anime that I typically like is anything that's well. Um. I watched Classroom with the Elite already. I've watched it already. Spice and Wolf was good. And the Classroom of the Elite started great, and then I ended up hating it. I ended up not liking it. I'm not really into to sport animes, no. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not too big on it. Delicious and what? Beyond Journeys? No, I have not. A uh, movie? Maybe I might like it. Is it on Crunchyroll? Is it on Crunchyroll? Cowboy Bebop, of course. Well, I mean that's that's like you know the typicals. I'm talking about like something new recently. Demon Slayer? No, I'm good. I already tried being Demon Slayer. You can hate me, but I ain't liking it. I don't like Demon Slayer. Kaiju? No, I'm good with that one. Oh wait, number eight? Oh no, I'm sorry. I thought you meant uh, Jutsu. Uh, no, I haven't seen that. Sorry, hold on. I was focusing for a second. Mm, question, dub or subbed? Um, if I'm doing laundry, I'm going to watch dub. If I am paying full attention to it, it's going to be all it's going to be all sub. I watch both. Killing frenzy. Oh no. All because I'm just chilling over here. That I was rewatching Naruto? I am, but I want to watch some other anime besides just rewatching Naruto. <laughs> you know? I watch both. If the anime is really good in dubbed, I would prefer to watch it in dubbed. But if the dub sucks, I will switch to sub immediately. I feel cornered over here because I know that if I go over there, I might get shot out from the corner. Mr. Ghost. Um, Full Metal. I've already seen that a long time ago. But yeah, it does have a good dub. And I like the good dub of uh, certain animes. Like, Attack on Titan had the best dub. It had the best dub. Fake Grand Order. Um. Oh my gosh! These guys are trying to get me so hard. <laughs> I feel so bad. I'm sorry. This is uh, this is just 16. <laughs> this is lobotomy. Uh, this is funny. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm still I'm still listening. Uh, Spy X Family is one of my favorites. Yeah, I do like Spy X Family. That's really good. It's really good. Um, I remember I I miss playing old Xbox, and then I'd be like, imagine getting killed by a girl, and they it would make them so enraged. <laughs> oh, it was always so funny. I miss those days. Babysitting. Running, running. running riot! No way! No way! <laughs> uh, 
the way of the house husband? Sounds like something I would say, really? Yeah, well, it was. It was absolutely something I would say. I just want to see who can kill me at this point. Anybody want to match me? Anybody want to get me, huh? Anybody want to try me? Alright, let's see. Uh oh. I just want to keep my- I want to keep my thing now. Okay, I'm gonna lose now. I'm not gonna lose. I'm gonna die now, but oh my gosh. I'm sorry. Perfection! What? I got a perfection trophy! I got zero deaths and 17 kills? <laughs> you know they mad. You know they mad. <laughs> and I'm over here chatting with you guys about anime. <laughs> Imagine dying to a gamer girl. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Oh my gosh. That was actually embarrassing. Yes, it was. I've never got that before. I don't play Halo as much as I want to. I got a running riot and a perfect. I got 15 plus kills with no deaths. Pretty cool. Say that again. Power of anime. My laugh is infectious. <laughs> what? I watched Dr. Stone. You know what? I have been meaning to watch that one, and I never got around to it. Zombieland? No, I haven't seen that one. I did not get that, that one. Berserk? Yeah, I know that one's good, but I don't think that one's quite up my alley. You were so invested in the topic, you didn't see me pop off as much. Yeah, I was sitting there just popping off the whole time while we're chatting. And I didn't die once. <laughs> oh, man. Assassination Classroom? I did, and it wasn't up my alley either. I'm very picky. But, like, for instance, if you're going to send me something girly, then at least have it be the standard of, like, the, the new Fruits Basket. Like, I like Fruits Basket. If it's gonna be girly. If it's gonna be like manime, it's gotta be kind of like Naruto. If it's gonna be um, drama, if it's gonna be like a drama type, it's gotta be like, mm, let's see. What's the best, what's the best drama one I like? Um, I'm trying to think. Uh, la, 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 la. Shonen or romance? Uh, I I watch a bit of everything. Um, watch a bit of everything. <laughs> Dangers in your heart. What is that? I'm just. I've watched Tokyo Ghoul. Yeah, I've seen Love Is War. That's one of my favorite animes. Oh. Uh. What streaming services do I have? Uh, just crunchy roll. I like his armor. Just crunchy. Also, Kirigaya, welcome to the meme champs. I'm sorry, I didn't get to say hi. <laughs> you loved kaiju? Mm, I haven't seen the dragon maid yet, but I will. I have it on my wish list. I mean, my wish list. I have it on my watch list. Delivery service? Um, no. Grand Blue? Oh, I um, I had a friend who really liked that. I I didn't get into it. I've seen Love Is War before. Love Is War is one of my favorites. You and Kaido did a stream together. Oh, shut up! We ain't going that way. Don't even put me in that category. Enemy sniper! The Enemy sniper. Uh -oh, I can't see. Um. um, if we do a movie night, I'm gonna be very distracted by everybody chatting the whole time. <laughs> I wouldn't actually be watching the anime or whatever. Oh, I wouldn't be actually watching it. Oh shoot. 
every anime is kind of lewd. Even Naruto is kind of lewd with the sexy jutsu. Every anime has got its fan service. People go into it knowing. Got him. Got him a little good right there. Oh no. Ah, oh, you stupid. Stupid. <clears throat> stage? You can't you can't stream anything on the stage. I it's stupid, but you can't. Yeah, I don't understand why it's like that either. Oh shoot, I didn't give him that kill up there. How is the games going? They're going. Who the heck is VIP? Oh, great. Don't make it me. Don't make it me. I'm about to die. All right. Oh, Spice and Wolf had a freaking crap ton of fan service. The heck? Did I become VIP at the time I killed him? I did. I did become VIP when I killed him. Nice. Oh, man. Why is he VIP now? Oh, because I got my kill already, right? Oh, boy. Slime anime? Uh, I watched that one. I wasn't into it. I just... I don't know. I wasn't... It wasn't giving me the interest vibes, you know? Enemy VIP eliminated. Enemy VIP eliminated. Oh, crap. <clears throat> ah. Um, yeah, I roommate is a cat. I watched that one. It was all right. I wasn't big on it. I'm like I said, I'm very picky on my anime. <laughs> Got to kill. Hunter x Hunter. Uh, I actually just never got into that one either. I didn't try to give it a shot though. Chainsaw Man? Didn't watch it. I didn't like the slime one because I just... Oh, did you guys watch the one about the dragon? I watched one recently. It was like a cute little wholesome... Like It was about like a dragon trying to find its home. It was really cute. I thought it was a really cute anime. Um, it was like it was like a dragon and he can't protect himself very well But he was trying to find like a like a home in like real estate It was just cute because this elf was like basically like the real estate master and he was helping the dragon find a um, Find a home. It was cute. It was I, I actually enjoyed that one and I was surprised It wasn't like the best voice acting ever and it was a little annoying, but it was still cute. What is it called? Does someone know what it's called? It, dra Dragon goes house hunting. Yeah, is that the name of it? I don't. Gotcha. <laughs> oh gosh. Windbreaker. Which one is that one? Oh, I'm dead. He got me. He got me with that. Thoughts on girls last tour? I didn't see it. Did I watch Komi Can't Communicate? I read the manga and I didn't like it. I think because the the guy character, I don't know. I just didn't like him. Uh, I read a lot of manga when I can. Honestly, I prefer manga over anime because then if it does become an anime, then I'm super excited about it. And usually I'm not disappointed. Usually. Sweetness and lightning? Yeah, I haven't heard that one. I like sweet anime too. Oop, I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry, buddy. You read manga? Oh, gosh. 
I got caught off gourd. <laughs> the Great Pretender. I have access to Netflix, yeah. But I'm not big on Netflix anime. Sometimes they're so corny, I just can't help. Like, they're just so corny. I did like the opening of Windbreaker, you're right, I did. I did watch Cyberpunk and it was alright. It was aight. It wasn't my style. It wasn't really my style. You got a sniper? You trying to snipe? You trying to snipe? You trying to snipe? You trying to s- <laughs> I'm making him mad. <laughs> you trying to snipe? Uh, he's waiting to get that VIP so he can snipe. You're a pretender! Great pretender. You're a pretender. <laughs> Trigun is an old one, but good one. Yeah, you know what? I had all the CDs because of my brother a long time ago. I don't even know if it's still, it's probably still at my mom. Nice. Nice. New VIP, are we? We can win. Hi, Yaddy. I haven't seen you in a hot minute. What's going on? What's going with you? How's it going? How's it going? VIP I'm VIP. Let me kill the other VIP. Hold on. Don't kill him, Monic. What the frick? I'm VIP. Oh my gosh. You're an idiot. Got him. Got him. All right, we're, we're 9v1. Just don't die. Whoever's VIP next, don't die. Just don't die. Do not die to the VIP. They're not getting wrecked, though. We're like, we're 9v1. Get out of the way. Don't let me die by the VIP, please. Let me kill that VIP. Did we get him? We went- No! What the frick? He died by the VIP! Idiots! Idiots. Oh my gosh. Right when I got us even, too. So dumb. Oh well. Um, No spiral. Why does that sound familiar? Yeah, that guy got killed by the VIP. Like, you're not, you're supposed to not get killed on or get killed by the VIP. Goodness gracious. Well, the guy running after the VIP was just like, oh, let me go run after the VIP. Like, why did you do that? Just stay away from it. Worry about your own teammates getting the freaking VIP kill. I have very incompetent players. It's alright, it don't matter. Like I said, I'm having fun still, regardless. I'm still having fun. What is that? Oh, right. There we go. I want to watch. Okay, so this is my watch list. I'm going to go to my crunchy roll. Watch list real quick. Let me show you. And tell me if there's something that's like sucks or something. Oh, wait, I gotta re log in. Crap. Uh, what was my login again? Uh, oh, yeah, I forgot they merged with Funimation, right? They merged with Funimation, yet I couldn't even watch Naruto in dubbed while I was doing laundry. Lame. All right, so my watch list. My list I have. Uh, Fruits Basket, which I'm already watching. Um, Spy's Family, I already watched it. Tony Kawa, I already watched it. Um, okay, so I'm actually, I've already caught up on this list. Um, Kotorua san, um, um, uh, Koekomo, I don't know what that is. Um, 80, 86, 86 is on here, which I'm probably gonna watch next. 
because of my friend. Sound, blend S. Uh, why is what is Buddy Daddies? It's on my list for apparently. <laughs> um, what else? Those are my newest ones that I haven't some haven't gotten to. Um, wise man's grandchild. I don't know why Fire Force is still on my list. I didn't like it. Uh, it's a comedy. I have to watch it. Ah, uh, yes, the dads. Oh, <laughs> uh, you read the original book of '86 and loved it. Yeah, uh, my friend was like, "You have to watch it. Yeah, I have to watch it." I'm like, "All right, well, I'll put it on my list." So it's on the list. A duo assassin team? Oh, that sounds great. So it's basically like Spy X Family, but with guys. <laughs> Wise man's grand grandchild. It was mid, was it? Maybe I'll take it off then. Don't be sad if it's depressing. 86? Huh. I'll have to try it. I'll try it anyway. I don't care if it's depressing. Okay, listen. Nothing can be as depressing as that one anime I watched. Uh, I forgot the name of it already. I think it was like Yama something. The guy who turned into like a robot. I forgot. And he like killed everybody. And he was like, you watch One Piece? No. And then he like shoots her. <laughs> what was it called again? <laughs> no, not Parasite. No, it was a really awful one. Hi, Grab. How you doing? Oh, that anime. Yeah, yeah. I forgot the name of it. Hi, Blayton. What's going on? Welcome in. <laughs> um, Hello, Lita Lee. Who the heck are you people? Where are you coming from? Yeah, Inu Inuyashiki. That was the one. That I was like, nothing can be as depressing as that one. <laughs> that one was just so out of pocket. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Grave of the Fireflies? I'll put it on my list. You know what? Forget it. I don't want I'm not gonna take any of your opinions. I'm gonna watch Pokemon. <laughs> I did watch Clanid. I didn't like it. I know. Sue me. <laughs> Wastoria? I actually heard about that one. Um maybe I'll give it a go. Don't you say Orin Hose Club? I ain't watching that. <laughs> Grave of the Fireflies is on Netflix. Oh, no. The Byakugan. No. That's it. I'm going to watch Shippuden. I'm going to watch all of Shippuden. And then I'm going to watch the horrible remake of Naruto. A.K.A. the How Much Can We Milk This Anime For starring Boruto. <laughs> uh, Corey in the house. Oh, you're funny. <laughs> Oh man, I hated the Naruto ending. Violet Evergarden. I heard that a lot of people like that one. Um, another. I'm not really big into the scurry animes because I don't find them scurry. They're just weird. You know, I'll just watch ghost stories. <laughs> <coughs> Hello, Grigoro. Whatever the heck. Uh, welcome to the meme jams. How you doing? Garfield the anime. Can't wait. I'll watch that one. Of stories dubbed. <laughs> no. <laughs> Avatar The Last Airbender. I love... I, I've watched that through so many times. <laughs> um, I did not like... Okay, listen. I think Hinata could have been a better character. And I hate the way Kishimoto uh, made female protagonists. I think he did a terrible, awful job at making strong women in, in Naruto. And the only strong one was Tsunade. Um, and I feel like the romance was rushed. I feel like it was not good. And, um, that's just, it just is what it is. I think Naruto was too obsessed over Sasuke and vice versa. And it was almost borderline just too much weird. And I just think that there was just, there was a lot that just was, oops, there was just a lot that was just not good about the ending. I thought their fight was great. Their great, their fight was great. But everything else after that was just like, okay, crap, we got to make another anime. We got to cash cow it. Hi, Silver Wolf. How are you doing? Welcome in. How's the list? Well, I was talking about it. <laughs> Naruto is from. <laughs> Naruto is from. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm 
sorry, hold on. I was making a joke. <laughs> Naruto is a <laughs> I'm sorry, hold on. My signs. Oh, what I was trying to get at is that the he really wrote the, the female characters really bad. <laughs> and Naruto was basically <laughs> Narza was basically from the village hidden in the closet. <laughs> Man, that boy was too obsessed. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That was just hilarious to me. <laughs> Am I wrong? Am I wrong? <laughs> every five seconds. Sasuke! Like every five seconds. <laughs> <laughs> oh. uh. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, I think the ending was rushed. I think there's gonna be a lot more. Um, Sasuke said he wanted to uh, he wanted to revive his clan, his clan, right? So he he has one child that is a daughter, and then just sticks to that. How is that repopulating your clan? <laughs> one daughter who's probably gonna marry into another family. <laughs> that doesn't seem much like a getting back the Uchiha clan. So anyway, there's a lot of things that didn't make sense to me. He should have had multiple children. Sasuke should have had like at least 10. <laughs> and to have a daughter with glasses too? Oh, that's such that's so ironic. Um What? Jeez what? Naruto hidden in the closet. <laughs> The village hidden. <laughs> I swear. Anyway, I still enjoy Naruto though. I think Hinata could have been what better written. I think Sakura was really irritating. I tried liking her. I really did. I really tried liking Sakura, but nothing she does, even when she works with Tsunade, like, and you could tell he panicked. He was like, man, she sucks as a character. I gotta make her good. Even when you could tell that, like, when she was getting stronger, I, she, man, I just could not like her. I could not like her. Sakura was so awful. Like, they should have... She could have been such an amazing character. And no. Like, oh my gosh. New VIP. Killer B was, the like, so awesome. And one of my favorites was Rock Lee. Like, I really did try liking, liking Sakura. I really did. But all she came out across to me was so freaking, like, she was so, like, she's like, oh, I'm so in love with Sasuke. And, like, she literally knew nothing about him at all. She was all surface level, all looks. If it wasn't for his looks, do you think she would be head over heels over Sasuke? No. No. And she's like over here dropping all her morals saying, you know, if you leave the village, I'll leave with you and basically become a rogue ninja and a criminal. Like she literally it was like ride or die to the point of toxicity. She was such a terrible character. I think what would have been a redeeming for Sakura if she would have moved on. That would have been the only redeeming point for her if she moved on. And then Sasuke could have been with Karen or something. Another Uzumaki? <laughs> because he couldn't have the real one! <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done joking. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. Sasuke getting with another Uzumaki. No, <laughs> And he can revive his clan with that one. <laughs> I think Naruto Hinata is fine. I'm not really a fan of Naruto and Hinata, but I think it's fine. It, it works because it made sense. But Sakura and Sasuke did not make sense to me. She was too obsessive to the point where it was just awful. No laughing. All right, fine. I won't laugh. Jeez. Brat. Conan? Really? Oh, sorry. Hold on. Aw, oh, man. I just gave them a point because I was trying to put the freaking timer on. Take your points back. Whatever. Yeah, but anyway. So isn't Sasuke supposed to be super rich? Um, he didn't even know his kid for the first 12 years, and he didn't even recognize her. Listen, I understand that the, he was trying to become... He doesn't know how to be a father because he never had a father that was really supportive. Or a family because, you know, they got slaughtered. Um, but at the same time, it really isn't that hard to maternally care about your child. 
<laughs> Literally, <laughs> Serata has daddy issues because her daddy is never there. It's always around Naruto instead. The supporting Kage arc is what that is all about. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Imagine having a child and leaving and only having one child and saying, yeah, I'm gonna revive the village or oh, I'm gonna revive my clan and then just never be there. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, he's doing something. I am not drawing another Naruto drawing. No, thank you. I'm good. I'm good. He went for- he went to get the milk in a different village. <laughs> With one hand! <laughs> uh, at least he came back, though. He almost killed his daughter, you know, coming back, but still. At least he came back. You can't- beggars can't be choosers! Yeah, he is considered a terrorist. He came back with the milk. He said one child's enough to revive my clan, and it's, again, it's a female. It's a female who's gonna marry into another clan. You're not reviving the clan! <laughs> Massive crab! Thank you so much for 37 months. That's crazy, man. I don't mind Baruto. I think... I think he's alright. I don't really like the whole... Spin off! Oh my gosh, this kid. I mean, this guy has killed me three times. I love Itachi. Itachi sets the standard for older brothers. I mean, maybe not to kill the clan, but... <laughs> uh, shut up, Amvi! I didn't do no such thing! That was literally... Anyway. Barzo is trash. It literally, this kid becomes like super OP and makes Naruto and Sasuke seem like lame. It just makes it, shut up, Satoshi. It makes uh, Sasuke. Shut up. Listen, if Sasuke was a girl, if Sasuke was a girl, all right, would this story be different? Yes, yes, I would. Yes, I would. He should have been a girl. Sasuke. Oh gosh, no, you ain't gonna. I just- why, Massive Cram? Why? You made me stick myself! Defeat. Goodness gracious! I just stuck myself because you forced me to spin! <gasps> you brats! Whatever. You know they made an anime about Berto's dad? <laughs> yeah, back in 2002. <laughs> uh, shut up, Brown. You don't know nothing about me. Uh, you lost me? No. Uh, freedom? Shut up. No, I have not. You have no proof. Just like air gear? Yeah. You know what? Ew. Oh my gosh. If that was a spider inside of this, I'm gonna... I want to die. I did not just blow a spider onto my lap. With my kazoo. Because it was inside my kazoo. <sighs> I am so grossed out. I want to go to bed. I, I honestly, I'm, I want to go to bed. That was so gross. I want to go to bed. I want to- SHUT UP! DESERVED! And now it's on my carpet. <coughs> <coughs> that was disgusting. Little slave. I hate spiders. <laughs> Stupid spider in my kazoo! Why did you evict my boy? What? He already paid his rent for the month. <laughs> 
Oh my gosh. I blew him out of it. <laughs> Stupid. Yeah, I'm glad I didn't inhale. If I would have inhaled, I would have just ate a spider. And I'm genuinely, I'm just thinking of my life choices right now. And I'm very much disgusted. I'm very disgusted. I am thinking about it. Shut up. I, I, oh, I don't want to ever think about the chances of me eating a spider in my sleep. It's zero. It's zero. You hear me? It's zero. It's zero. That is so nasty. I just can't. Hey now, hey now. Oh crap. I don't know how I just survived that. I had three of them on my tail. I did not eat a bug once in my lifetime. We ain't talking about that. Did not happen. Lost the league, did we? Now we didn't. Lost the league, my butt. Lost the league, my butt. Lost the league, my butt. I'd ate a... If I would have ate a spider, I honestly... I would have just straight went to bed. I'm serious. I would have went to bed. It would have been over. Over. Would have been over. Would have been over. Funniest thing you heard all night. Yeah, no. I'm never going to blow a kazoo without looking at it ever again. Ever again. Ever again. <clears throat> the My extra throat protein feels itchy though, now. pairs well with ticks. There was ticks. probably a spider web in there. They're nature's fruit gushers. Nature's fruit gushers. Get out of here. Nasty. Wow. He couldn't even simply get me. Killing Frenzy again? Am I just playing crack today or what? Am I just playing crack while I'm not even paying it? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what this game is anymore. I don't even know what's going on. Literally just being cracked. Literally just going off. I haven't died, have I? Oh my gosh. I just got three double kills in a row? What is going on? Am I okay today or what? Like... What is going on with me? I'm just chilling. What am I doing? Face clan, you're funny. Hi, Amish. Oh, here's the meme champs. I'm probably gonna die now because now I'm aware of it. I'm aware of it now. What the fudge? A running riot? What is going on? A second running riot today? A second one within an hour? What is going on? What the frick is going on? Halfway to victory. I guess this is associating from the spider. What in the world is going on? Locked in, I guess. It's so crazy. Good morning, JY. How much am I paying these actors? You're funny. Yeah. Spider. Are they in there? Look at this. I got zero deaths and 16 kills. Oh! Please don't kill me now. I don't want to die now. I don't want to die now. I got a running riot. I want to keep it. Now I don't. Now I am going to try. Now I am going to try. Hi, Insanity. What is the meme champs? I'm going to try now. I don't want to die. Dev, we need you back. Corey is Dev. getting too good again. Dev you need to bring her down so a notch. Bad. What are you talking about? Now I do want to try. I don't want to die. 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 I'm overthinking it. I'm overthinking it. I don't want to die. I got a running right now, and I'm now I'm trying to play, and I'm scared. Okay. Now I'm going to play terribly. I know he's over here. I guess not. Uh, 
Oh, goodness gracious. What an idiot. He went up the stairs and then around. Whatever. I got one death now. I'm carrying a crap team again, like always. All right, I don't care now. I already got that death. I'm, I don't, I'm, the try hard is gone. The try hard went away now. I don't care anymore. I just didn't want to die in this match either. I would have got a perfect, a stained record, yes. I saw you up there, little brat. I saw you up there, little brat. I saw you up there, little brat. So close, yeah. Well, now I'm just gonna go off on him, cause, yeah, whatever. I'm mad. Gotcha. <laughs> Loser. Imagine being that pathetic. Uninstall the game. Oh. On the end, I'm still on fire. No, I died once and I'm upset. Got him. Don't tell me I have to carry my team on here too. Who's dying on my team purposely? I swear. Okay, at least I got another killing spree. Or... That's good. I guess. Listen, I get the first shot. I get the first shot. I get the first shot. Always. Also, hi, lifting dude. Good to see you again. And historical mustache. Where you been? It's good to see you again. Who's shooting over here? No hesitation, too? Yeah. He almost got me. Almost. But not. Oop. Run button. I got scared. I thought he was coming after me. Ooh. I see ya. How do I afford these actors? They're funny. Could we win already? Or what? Lurking around. I'm still mad that I died. I'm mad that I died that one time. So mad. So mad. Where are they at? They're down there. Oh, we win. Uh, 24 to 1 death. I would have had a perfect... But all right, that's fine. I got a running riot. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Thank you for the lurk historical, by the way. I appreciate it. What? I got a chill. This is my second time. They hiding from me for real, for real. For real, for real. Your English professor. Uh, yeah, 24 to 1. I got my... Uh... I would have had a perfect. I would have had a perfect if I would have just not died. That one time. Oh, well. I'll do it again. <coughs> <coughs> I'm just chill today, yo. It was the overthinking that got me not killed. You're right. If I was just chill and not trying, I probably wouldn't have died. <laughs> oh. Hi, Techno Reaper. It's good to see you again. Ark Ascended is almost done downloading. Really? I might play tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow I will play Ark. Maybe. Big ol' maybe. Big ol' maybe. Maybe. Yeah, whenever I try to play a game, I suck. But when I don't try to play a game, I'm good. A remaster of the original Halo? Uh, yeah, of course I'd play it. Of course I would. Did you guys ever see that video? Did you guys ever see that video of a- um, I forgot his name, but he did the speed running. He- he was infamous for getting, uh, a Guinness World Record about Halo speed running. Only to find out that he cheated. And, uh, I saw the- and he was on chat getting just roasted. So- <coughs> That video is so funny to me. Because the guy- you know, Wait, did you not see it? You didn't see it? Oh my gosh, we gotta watch it. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Spongebob. Halo speed run. Oh my gosh, no way you guys didn't see this. 
This guy, the most embarrassing speedrunner. He literally sat here the entire time. For actually, uh, Moist Critical just did one. Hold on, let me get back to the game. I'll show you in a minute. We're gonna we'll watch it. Actually, we'll watch it. Why not? It was hilarious. I was dying. Hold on. I love to smile. I love to laugh. I love a vibrant sunset with a nice cool breeze. And okay, more than on. any of those things, this is 33 minutes, I so love hold on. to speed run. And speed running is where all of that I listed goes to die. Even though I have a fiery passion for speed running, there is nothing on the planet that can make me angrier. Getting deep into a run Let's that I've practiced it. for Here weeks we only to have it Whether all go tits really up at the very end through some go. random RNG nonsense. And He's a little crude, but pause. here. The game so she can talk about her grandma that died from okay, cancer. Okay, so, so this guy over the years, there's been there we go. Also this guy examples of how things are was doing a speed run, this entire four hour run, and, and boy, basically, something. being a runner, myself, he did so bad. He didn't even pick up the pistol at all doing the speed run. He did this, this in front of live chat and in, in front of all these people, look, so if you don't like he did them in front of all these people. The terribleness in front of you, <laughs> and um, it was so bad. Here, just watch. Don't get your hopes up, bro. You're not going to see him here either. Cody's Pillar of Autumn actually starts off well. He messed up the first jump, pipe jump, and bonked into the wall, but hey, happens to the best of us, and otherwise, this is good so far. Is Paul Miller related to you? 25 minutes. Yeah, he's serious time right now. Can't get anything out of him. As we all know, the most entertaining speedruns are the ones where the runner doesn't talk at all or explain what they're doing. Boring is the best way to describe his Pillar of Autumn run. It's mostly him slowly killing all the enemies in each room, but he doesn't die at all, so if you're unfamiliar, Familiar with the speed run, you may think this is how it's supposed to look, and Halo runs are just boring and slow. For example, in this room, the classic strat was to stick one elite, throw a plasma at the door, and make a break for it. <laughs> Mind you, he didn't pick up the pistol at all. He kept dropping Instead, it. Instead, Cody sits here for two minutes, struggling to kill everybody. Even if you are gonna try to clear the room, it should not take him this long. Also, why did Bro not grab the Magnum? Have you never played CE before? I managed to get a hold of the high-speed Halo world records at the time of Cody's run, and the world record for Pillar of Autumn was 519. I timed Cody's here as 829. Not very good. That being said, Pillar of Autumn was far and away the level that went the best for Cody. It's all downhill from here. Cody starts off Halo by crossing the bridge. This is fine. That's what you're supposed to do, right? <laughs> Wrong. No. The first real <laughs> trick of the game at the time was supposed where you to get walk over it. here, do a grenade jump, and skip the bridge. This saves a couple seconds versus walking, but we mainly do it to skip a trigger. There'd normally be two Banshees and a Covenant squad up and he keeps going across the bridge the, the entire time. And there's time. For a like, as if he didn't even it. know how to do a speed run. To do it. Let's see how he does. <laughs> oh, I'm the best. <laughs> oh, no. Well, maybe now he'll do the and grenade he jump. Nope, he's just walking back across the bridge. So Alrighty, many God. times. Now he can advance to the next area. Why are you dropping the Magnum? I didn't shoot. <laughs> <laughs> Man, bro, maybe you wouldn't have died there if you could just headshot the Elite when his shields this are down. You lie. Oh, no. In this section today, we'll kill at least five of the six marines here to skip both dialogue and an entire dropship. One Halo speedrun meme you may know, as said by Paul Russell. Marty, he's killing the marines. But back in 2011, Halo runners didn't kill any marine here, which meant there was dialogue before every ship and you had five to take out. But even without modern grenade lineups, they're all fairly easy if you know what you're doing. You mainly just grenade the elites as they he come lied, out and clean he, up he everyone got the, else. The world On the first record. ship, Cody inexplicably runs to the left to take out jackals. It runs first, cheating. retreats, and then dies. Then dies again and says something you probably never want to hear in a live speed run. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot. I, I forgot how to do this part. I just wish he I could see chat. A strategy I, use I as wish a I could see chat. And it scared me, which is to be safe and stay on top of the structure. He proceeds to die anyway. It's actually the exact opposite. He's playing too passively. But like I said <laughs> earlier, this run gives the impression that CE speedrunning is supposed to be slow and boring, where you take your time. <laughs> He's speed running. going well. Yeah. Cody was I think also my the nephew could do a better job of century. playing through After a more deaths, Cody decided <laughs> through to do something stupid not level. typically seen in a legendary speedrun, which is to he change does the so bad he changes the difficulty from her from legendary to heroic, from her from legendary to heroic. So, <laughs> so it wasn't enough. It wasn't enough that he couldn't even. Get but the wait, guys, wait, it gets worse because even on heroic,
the difficulty to it hero. was so bad that even on heroic <laughs> he changes it to normal like he should have just After went through the whole thing to just, go to just go to easy just go to easy mode and he would have still like struggled halo reach is canon. <laughs> <laughs> just got a website halo reach is not canon.net <laughs> <laughs> The guy sitting in Cody's <laughs> right was another speedrunner who was at GDQ to run Trials HD and Tony Hawk Pro Skater. I, everyone Even in this room is so runner, embarrassed. He does his best to explain backpack reloading in a desperate attempt to make this run at least somewhat informative despite Cody's refusal to explain anything. Often you'll notice that you, you don't actually see Cody He's not even getting the reloading. shot. <laughs> and that's because you can... Um, is it, if you this is like the first reload, time he's ever played the game with the way he's playing. Yeah. <laughs> so he successfully does a cutscene skip on the light bridge, but more importantly answers a question about what tricks he's going to do. Uh, does light ask, Cody, are you doing AOT, CR, fall, silent cartographer launch, and or keys shield bump? Key shield bump, no. Assault in the control room, maybe. Silent cartographer, definitely. I don't know what's funnier, them feeling the need to ask if he was going to do basic tricks, or him saying yes to only one. I, I would I would go to Legendary for the library. Cody <laughs> is saying he would raise a difficulty on the library. Keep this statement in the back of your mind. So he the says he's going to go back to Legendary. Enough. There's three areas where you're supposed right? to save Marines, but if the Marines die, the game lets you progress anyway, so it's fastest to just kill them at the first two areas and then move on. Do you want to explain why you're <laughs> shooting your own Marines? Cody, can you please explain to the viewers what you're doing? Yeah. No. <laughs> While Cody was slowly clearing the last area, a donator decided to roast one of the guys on camera. Uh, Agatrod says, I'll donate five dollars if the guy with the long hair says, I make the best armor in all of Soul Titan. <laughs> hey, after half an hour of just the second level, Cody's finally gotten through. Unfortunately, there are 10 42 levels minutes. in Halo CE total. 42 minutes. Because I haven't practiced this game in like two years, this is pretty tough. Then why did you agree to do it? In runs now, we'll pretty much just run past this entire opening. In every old run I'd seen before, they'd stay back here and take guys out, so I figured Cody would do the same, but he attempted to rush and completely failed at it. He then walks off a cliff by accident. Mind you, Expert he's playing on heroic here, don't walk now. Off the cliff. But it's okay, because now he's worked his way back and ready to push through. He did it again. That wasn't a replay. He actually did it again. He dies his third attempt, too, but at least it was in a conventional way. Progress. I think a five-year-old can play this game mark, The chat starts asking if someone other than Cody can try to play. <laughs> Bob the Champa, only Cody Miller will be playing Halo. No one else is taking the the controller. After meandering his way through the level, which isn't ideal in a speedrun, Cody finally enters the Covenant ship. In Halo Runs today, there's a trick called Belly Skip that lets you skip this entire section as well as the next main room, formerly known as the RNG room. Even still, the belly isn't too difficult to take care of if you know what you're doing. On Legendary, there's 10 waves with random spawns. Some of these waves will have gold sword elites, while others will just be jackals and or grunts. When playing on Heroic, like Cody, instead of gold elites, you get stealth elites. Cody gives himself a dose of copium by arguing that stealth elites, which have no shields are actually stronger than gold elites, the highest ranking elites in the game. And yeah, legendary those guys are gold, so it's actually, uh, it can be somewhat more difficult on heroic. It could be somewhat more difficult on heroic. Bro is coping right now. It could be somewhat more difficult on heroic. So he's trying to make it seem like, like when he switched it to heroic, that it's still difficult. <laughs> <laughs> In the middle of all this, the stream receives a very special donation. And a uh, person said hi to you, Ghost Rope donated five dollars also. Thank you. Yeah, Goat Rope. Yeah, Goat Rope. If you don't know who Go Rope is, he's a Halo speedrunner who's been around since the beginning. Pulling this run in front of him is the equivalent of butchering the Star Spangled Banner in front of Francis Scott Key. In the RNG room, there's three doors and you need one of them to open, except only the Covenant can open them. If you don't get a sleeping grunt spawn, you can try to bait and lead into opening one, or worse comes to worse, you can start clearing the room to spawn more waves and run through then. Cody instead wanders back and forth for a couple minutes before realizing he needs to get more enemies to spawn, and then he dies. Eventually he <laughs> makes it through though, and now it's time for the first major embarrassing trick screw up of the run. So you're supposed to do a grenade jump here. The grenade jump that I had always seen was like this, where you throw two plasmas, one really high, one on the floor, and then a frag. Do a this jump. doesn't kill us because we pick up the overshield, and while the overshield is charging up, you're invincible. <coughs> from the second floor, you do another jump onto a dropship. Then from the dropship, you do one more grenade jump to the third floor. I found a run from way back in 2007 that did it this way, so I know for a fact that this was a strat at the time of Cody's run. However, I also found old runs that did this. This is from famous Hello, Halo runner Subwhistle. This is three plasmas and one frag to get you all the way onto the dropship. Cody does a weird amalgamation of this where he throws three plasmas like he's gonna do the dropship jump, but then he doesn't throw the last frag. The <laughs> results are less than desired. He just dies, doesn't he? Nope. Uh, nope. 
he just keeps failing. Oh, damn it, I have to jump. This room, this guy, this guy right here, <laughs> this guy right here, you can just tell it's just painful to sit here. <laughs> He's just so... <laughs> You know what, we'll just do this normally. <laughs> <laughs> Cody oh decides gosh. to stop trying. Not only does this mean he hey, now girl, has to fight all the way jams. to the top floor, this also, also prevents yes. another skip. <laughs> After finding keys, you're supposed to fight back to the hangar and leave in a dropship. But if you grenade jump to the second floor, the triggers in the hangar break, and the mission ends once you kill the sword elites on the bridge. Instead, Cody just plays through the level normally while dying a bunch of times. Do you not need to press that button? Oh shoot, I think you're right, I do have to press the button. Stuff up. No you don't, hurry up! Oh, yeah. Well, if you skip, the level ends here after this speech, because it gets screwed uh, up with the triggers. Yeah, thanks for telling us about the 15 minutes you didn't skip. Wait a sec, he got Literally, the end skip anyway. He's one he actually hour did a skip, even if accidentally. Now. That wasn't supposed to happen, but- And he's not even close to the middle of the game. Hey, after 37 minutes, he finally beat TNR. We are uh, so back. Oh bad. my god, we're only an hour and 20 minutes through this. I have three more hours of this shit. Silent Cartographer is probably the coolest I, I level in the game speedrun and has been for a really long time. Cody actually knows what to do here. He's not good at any of it, but he knows what to do. Basically, you turn around at the start, grab this warthog, drive into the facility, and fling yourself through this door before it locks. Normally, you'd have to go to a different part of the island to unlock it, but with that and then falling off in such a way that we don't die, we skip a huge chunk of this level. Let's see how Cody does. Get through it. But if you go around, if you... Uh... Uh... It's pretty oh, slick if you see the uh, and uh, high speed halo. It's super cool. Yeah. I miss. Oh, nice. He actually got it. Let's see the fall off. Oh wow. Yeah, that skips a lot of levels. Now, now another <laughs> skip. Here comes the hard part. This is painful hard. and. Yeah, Eventually he gets it. Then after messing up the simplest grenade jump imaginable a couple times, he gets an active camo and is able to run back to the top. Just Ten seconds. Hey, I've already got some. You're about to log into this like what? You do this. Maybe an attempt to trick. What? <laughs> Are you kidding? <laughs> All right, so this level still wasn't good, but at least it wasn't half an hour. On the Cody curve, this is a colossal W. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's followed by maybe the biggest L of the entire run. Assault in the control room is a pretty simple level, especially back in 2011. I don't think gonna leave so you the room find your way through the first room to the bridge. From the bridge, there's a trick called Bridge Fall, which was a legendary strat for a long this time, a and now it's only done on easy can't runs. Help but there's watch. three falls: the first one off the bridge, the second one onto a I would ledge, be so and then the third jump just to get down. The I second jump is so by far the hardest, and it's pretty tricky, but with a bit of practice, it isn't too bad. If you pull it off successfully, no enemies will spawn for the rest of the mission, and you'll be able to drive through the rest Who's in just hero? a few minutes. <laughs> Cody gets through the first room pretty quick, actually. Let's see how many tries it, it takes him to make get it, bridge But fall. in this case, he's not making it. <laughs> Man, I don't even know how to speedrun Halo 1. I do a better oh. job than this. Look at these guys, look at their face! Awesome. So he keeps dying! Oh my, god. oh my god, he got it. Now he just needs to fall off the right way. You have got to be kidding me. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of luck. Very... Just to clarify, it's not luck. If you do it right, you'll hit it every single time. The absolute best guide for this trick is from Nervy Destroyer. I'll link his video in the description. After several minutes of trying, Cody gave up, and instead of beating the longest level in the game in about seven minutes, he now has to play through it in its so entirety. He plays and through... I have... So he couldn't get the jump that he just wasted about 10 to 15 minutes on and after he couldn't get it he just continues to go through the long way the rest of the level to sit through the entire thing hang on a second yeah. <laughs> <Damn impressive>. <laughs> <laughs> and he still doesn't have the back <laughs> <laughs> Pro gamer stuff right here, folks. Why are you waiting for a marine to get it? You're literally getting out the right pistol. up here. There's a skip here I was hoping he'd know about. Oh, he didn't, of course, yeah. but you can actually hop on this glass and get to the other side early. This Even skip's I did like that. another five minutes at Even least. I for Cody, it would have saved 17 minutes. I've Worth done noting, that. Cody's time estimate for this run, the time that the event was planning around, was two hours. Runner. Now well past the two-hour mark, Cody is still on level five of ten. After several failed attempts, Cody steals a banshee you're not supposed to get. Then this happens. You're not you're supposed to get it. Oh wow. 
magic music. He also like, tries to give himself from? a dose of copium. The rest of the levels are so much easier. <laughs> we'll see about that one, Cody. Yeah, I'm going, what is this? What is that? The the what is this? That's the story. You have got to be kidding me. He actually did it. It took him 43 minutes longer than it should have, but still, he actually did it. 43 minutes. 220. 220, okay. See if we can do that. Look at his leg balance. Sorry, Cody, but both of us still have two more hours left of this. You Thankfully, 343 Guilty Spark is a pretty quick level. The legendary so world record at the time was 7 minutes 32 seconds, and Heroic, which remember he's now playing on, was only 617. And this level at the time really just had one not very hard trick with a checkpoint right before it, so you could try it over and over again. So this should be a quick one, and he's already going the wrong way. In the speed run, you're supposed to go left <laughs> at the start. On runs now, we do a grenade jump, but back in 2011, they were instead doing this jump hey, off Sonic. a rock. Either way, that would have saved him a bit of walking in combat. Combat. An easy trick that anyone can do that he just doesn't. Like, you don't have a chance. Stop dropping the magnum. So this part he of the game is when the, the twist happens and the flood is revealed, and this is the reveal room. This level isn't very hard, and Cody, despite a couple stupid deaths, is getting through it. Really, the only difficulty in this one is navigating your way through the facility, which is meant to be confusing. But for an experienced runner, that shouldn't be a problem. Wait, where is he going? This is back the way you came. What are you doing? There was grunts in the room before this one. So now I'm like actually legitimately lost. You agreed to speedrun this game, and you don't even know where to go. And you just died, and now we're all the way back to the start of the reveal oh room. My oh my gosh. Was, was actually manning the donation count. He just did a grenade jump to get back where he started. He actually made it to the shotgun room. We are so back. So after this elevator he's on now, there's a trick called camo jump, or camo jumo, where we grab active camo, do a jump you're not supposed to be able to do, and then you can run basically to the end while camouflaged. After grabbing camo, Cody tries to grenade jump and fails horribly. He didn't oh attempt it again. How do you fail it? And while camouflaged. After grabbing camo. Look at the way he just jumps over it. Okay. He fooled Tries everyone thinking that like everyone thought he was like the best speed runner. Jump. He j he literally jumps over it, fails it horribly. He onto the floor. Didn't attempt it again. He Any even semblance time of this it. being a speed run has now completely vanished and everyone in the room looks embarrassed for Cody. After a couple minutes, he does finally make his way out of the facility. But the level's not quite over yet. Yeah, we have what the game's finished, so... This is such pain. Okay, I'm going, I'm going. Cody, you're over your time estimate by half an hour and still have four levels left. All right, we're through. As funny as him getting lost is, that could have been a whole lot worse. To start the library, Cody saves and quits and lowers the difficulty to normal. He, okay, you remember, <laughs> you remember what he said? He said that, th th that it would be easier on Legendary? Whole lot remember what worse. he said that to earlier? Library, he changes saves... it to normal. He changed it from legendary to heroic, got his butt whoops, couldn't do any of the speed runs, and, and then and drops it to normal after he said, he was like, oh, well, the library will be easier on legendary. He puts it to normal. Difficulty to normal. I will now remind you of this from earlier. I'm, I, I, would, I would go This to is so embarrassing. What is chat saying? I wish I could see what the chat is saying. Okay. Normal is obviously different than legendary, but if I were running, I would still at least try to show off the legendary speedrun strats when, you know, you're at a speedrunning event. So at the time, the strategy was to walk forward to get Guilty Spark to move up, do a grenade jump, run back to trigger Guilty Spark again, and make your way to the first door without fighting any enemies. Cody does none of this and instead opts to plot his way along in the most uninteresting way possible. He then dies at the very start despite playing on normal. Oh my and gosh, he... <laughs> I can't. This is so painful. Not only does he keep dying now, he's dying on normal. He's dying on normal. Yeah. I can't. Uh, I the flood had no one <laughs> normal is so legendary. Like, well, the, the, the headshot is actually kind of in the body, sort of. You can't headshot Flood and CE, Cody. Speedruns of the library are actually pretty fun. There's a lot of cool <laughs> grenade jumps and ways to get through some of the hallways. <laughs> Not to mention now there's Flood bumping, well but Cody knew all the none way. of this stuff, and this level is just way. painful to watch. At just one point, he started running back the way he came, didn't realize it for like 30 seconds. He was also getting bad checkpoint luck, and there were a few times where he died, missed a checkpoint, and went back two plus minutes. Pain. A little over the three-hour mark, a woman enters the room before... <laughs> the woman <laughs> The woman enters quickly in. Quickly making the correct decision. <laughs> To leave. I counted seven deaths for Cody on the library despite playing on normal. Makes I can only imagine the comedy that would have ensued had he tried it on legendary. He gets out of library in about 25 minutes, which, all things considered, is a win despite being almost 11 minutes slower than the legendary world record at the time. Unfortunately for Cody, the next level is two betrayals. If you played Halo C before, you probably know the disaster that awaits. Two betrayals <laughs> now has an out of bounds trick involving a banshee that's cool conceptually but kind of boring to One watch, but classic two betrayal speedruns were actually <laughs> he's, insane. He's, he's, he's Way 
over 2011 the time. as later years, the legendary world record was still over 17 minutes, but there was a lot of I cool can. stuff Cody could still try to do. Like, check this out. On normal, you can just slide down to the bottom of the pyramid and get in the Banshee while the Wraith is still shooting at you. Cody instead opts to slowly work his way down while killing every enemy at a moderate pace. Oh, hey, there's a slide, and he died. And, he and now dies. he's back to the start because he didn't get a checkpoint. Nice. He's doing BK, that would be Trekhoff. He's, he's, he's Dark Side Phil's nemesis. They are Dark Side Phil, now there's a blast from the past. They're, they're probably just embarrassed. What games do I like? A lot. So how about them Jets boys? <laughs> <laughs> how about that Julian Assange, huh? Yeah, Julian Assange. Check by him. At this point, they're desperately trying to find anything other than the game to talk about. How many times can we say Chevy Chase within the next couple minutes? Because we said it Chevy a lot. Chase. Chevy, Chevy Chase. Chase. Chevy 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 Chase. Dan Aykroyd. Never ask again. I can't do this anymore, dude. This room you can so run past fairly <laughs> easily, at least on normal. Even in the footage you're watching, I got kind of unlucky with my flood and elite spawns, but still made it through mostly unscathed. Cody doesn't go this way, because why would he? I'm so wanting this to end right now. Me too, Cody. <laughs> so is Me everyone too. else in the Terrible. room. Everything was gray. You just drove over a health pack and rocket ammo. Grab it. Check this out in the second reactor room. I'm just going to throw a couple nades, rush in and activate this, which does take down your shields, then use a rocket and grenade to get back out. The pulse generator overloaded. One more to go. Oh my gosh. That was at least kind of interesting to watch and not that difficult. You got this, Cody. He's slowly trying to kill everything. There's a new Banshee to his right, and instead he grabs the old one with health damage. You cannot make this stuff up. There's an old strat that I don't know how to do because we don't use it anymore, so I'm taking this from the aforementioned Goat Ropes GDQ run in 2014, which is my favorite run ever. You're supposed to do the rest of the level on foot, but runners had this strat to get a ghost through the door. And to be clear, they were doing this at the time of Cody's run too. This lets Goat Rope drive to the end of the canyon to grab a Banshee, which he can then fly to the end with way quicker than if he had made his way on foot. Unsurprisingly, Cody doesn't even attempt the ghost trick and instead proceeds on foot. The remainder of the level takes him another 15 minutes. Oh my gosh. I know you guys are hating me right now. <laughs> no. This is one of the most awkward things I have ever sat through. So, someone, Cody, is trying to remind you there's a ghost um, somewhere here. Ask them where, because I forget. Oh, by the shit, not sweet for no. Even the chat is trying to backseat the game cheater. for him. Okay, finally, we're free. So I was actually tallying how many deaths Cody had on that level, and he had, you know what, actually, instead of telling you, why don't I show you? Hit it, Johnny. <laughs> yes. And he continues to die on normal. He's still dying on normal. Yeah, I know what uh -oh. <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> It's insane. It's a speedrun to death. Speedrun should have been how quick can I play Halo? Twenty-one. Yeah, the best he died twenty-one times in one level playing on normal at an event where he was invited to play on legendary. It took times. him over forty minutes. On twenty-one times. Imagine. Oh my gosh. Imagine dying twenty-one times on a game you you say you're so good at that you can speed run it and you are the Guinness World Record of it, right? But dying twenty-one times on the same level, on the same level on normal normal when the legendary record at the time was 1723. Anyway, on to keys. Keys should have been the shortest level of the run. This is another cheated, trick that why. I don't know how to do because it's an outdated trick. Back in Cody's day, you were supposed to do a shield bump out of bounds at the very start of the level, from which you can then do out of bounds platforming to get to the keys room. It turns a 20 minute level on legendary into a three to four minute level. But why, why can't you do the shield bump? It's just extremely difficult. Okay. At this point, I probably don't even need to tell you that Cody did not do this or even attempt it. You know what? Not. I don't even, I have no idea where I'm going. Oh god, not this again. He's actually making his way through fairly quick, at least by his standards to this point in the run. You can see Cody's in a groove. He starts talking about Metal Gear Solid. In, in Twin Snakes, suddenly Solid That's Snake insane. is like straight out of the Matrix. Yeah, that For once in the run, he finally he appears applauding. comfortable. And rightfully <laughs> so, because despite not doing the skip that would have made this the shortest level in the game, he gets through it in a little over 12 minutes, on normal. Once again, on the Cody curve, this is a W. 
Cody's told us a couple times during the run that he's pretty good at the last level. Well, it's just the last level though, like a chase away from he well, said he's last pretty good at the last level. So, yeah. no worries there. Cody, for a long time, had the world record on this level, the Maw, which was thought to be unbeatable due to a glitch he seemingly pulled off that no one had ever done prior or was able to replicate. There are hunters that bash open this set of doors and the doors on the other side, and you can use them to get on top of the map. This is called Cafe Bump. In anniversary graphics, you can see everything, but in classic graphics, you can't without some special maneuvering that they didn't know about back then. Cody magically gets vision, and long story short, now that we know what to do to get vision legitimately, we can say with confidence that what Cody did should not have worked. He cheated. At the time, this was yeah, just chalked up chance. as a super lucky glitch. All right, so I, I, really I think I still good. remember most of the tricks on oh, yeah. Let's get it, Cody. Show us how it's done. He already died. His next life, Cody attempts to do cafe bump, but again, this is before they knew how to get vision, so I'm not sure what he was going to do after, but it's a moot point because he was holding forward for some reason and died and got sent back to the start of the level. After a third oh death God. at the very start, once again, he's playing on normal, That's he insane. finally makes it to the bridge. Later on in the level, he doesn't grab a hidden overshield. Some would say this is because he didn't know it was there, but personally, I think he was going for a risky time save called No OS Hunter Hallway. Bravo, Miller. Unfortunately, he could have used the overshield because Hunter Hallway takes him down to one red. Normally in the reactor room back then, you do a small grenade jump up because it's a little faster and it can let you get all the reactors in one cycle without any waiting time. But because of his low health, Cody can't do this. He also walks up the wrong side, but at this point it doesn't really matter. After blowing up the first reactor, Cody falls off and has to walk all the way back up. But eventually he gets the last three and is able to get on the elevator and start the Warthog run. I would now like to flash back to a donation request on Pillar Bottom where someone asks Cody if he can stop to see the talking grunt. Five bucks is <laughs> oh, um, yeah, but you can't finish the level. You can't finish the level if you stop to see him? Well, here's footage of me stopping to see the grunt and still completing the Warthog run on Legendary with over a minute and a half remaining. I will give Cody credit for this. Hi, Zeds, how you doing? Welcome back. Yeah, oh, yeah. He nailed that 360. And that's Cody's run, just under four hours and 17 minutes. His time estimate may have been two hours and he may have had to lower the difficulty to normal, but that's still a finished run. The way they're clapping. That unfortunately did a lot of damage. They're not clapping because he did a good job. They're clapping because because he's finally ending. <laughs> we'll speed running at the time. Four hours and 16 minutes playing this on normal. Cody came back to GDQ the next year for a Halo Reach run that wasn't a complete <laughs> disaster. Like he did actually do a speed run, but it was still really slow and bad. And a lot of people thought Halo speed runs were slow and bad as a result. Combine this with high speed Halo.net not being very well run, the Halo runs community was pretty dormant for a while with it just being a small handful of people who communicated through Skype and recorded records on a Google Doc. GDQ didn't want to host any more Halo runs and they had to fight to get Unlucky a good Halo runner back, so but they the eventually got months. Mr. Monopoly invited to the January 2014 That's event crazy. to do an amazing Halo 2 run, which, combined with the newly formed HaloRuns.com, successfully brought Halo speedrunning back to life. Then in summer 2014, there was also Goat Rope CE run at the second GDQ event of the year, and later in 2014, the release of the Master Chief Collection, which had speedrun achievements and got a whole lot of people interested in learning routes for them and watching runners like Naked Eli. But yeah, Cody's run was really bad. It wasn't even that he was choking on tricks as much as he just wasn't good at the game. Like, even full path playing these levels should not have taken him as long as it did, and it's really painful to watch, especially after he lowers the difficulty to normal and is still sucking at the game. But if you are interested in watching good Halo speedruns, then the website to go to is <coughs> HaloRuns.com and for help doing runs yourself, join the Halo Runs Discord. All the tutorials and everything you need, you can find there. And if you like this video, then click the video on screen yeah, to watch me go over- That was insane though. I just imagine being invited to an event and embarrassing yourself that bad. That bad. Not only to be starting the game on Legendary, then changing it to Halo heroic and then saying the elites were harder on heroic and then said during the library that it'd be easier on legendary and then when he gets to the library he changes it to easy or not easy he changes it to normal continues to die 16 times my gosh what's the current best time i'm on i think it's like four hours something i don't actually know i'm not a speed runner i just thought this was hilarious and this came across my for you page and i'm like wow imagine lying to people that like and then just going through it like why go through with the event like one of two one or two things have probably happened like why he went to what i think the reason why he went is because a he probably thought that he could use his own equipment and then when he found out he couldn't use his own equipment, he probably was like, oh, okay, well, maybe I can go ahead and do it. Or B, he, thought, he genuinely thought that he could. <laughs> Whatever the case, he cheated. Um, and he got caught. He got um, basically called out as being a liar. 
<laughs> he bought into his own lie. And I honestly, if I was in his place, if I if I was in his place, I would have at least faked being sick or something. I would have been like, man, like at least it would have been like, man, I'm not on my game right now. I just don't feel good. Like at least something. He didn't even try. <laughs> he didn't even try to make any excuse. Straight lies. Just insane. I don't know. It's insane. It's hilarious though. I just thought it was the funniest thing in the world. <laughs> If I say I'm not feeling good, it's a lot. That's not what I'm saying, you little brat. But anyway, uh, one of those things. <laughs> um, let's see. So, other than that, I am I am probably gonna have to get ready for work tomorrow morning. I gotta get ready for to for work tomorrow morning. So, I'm gonna go ahead and call it a day. All right. You eat hot chip and lie. I do not eat hot chip and lie. Don't start with me. But um, I gotta I gotta get ready for. Well, I mean, not not get ready to work. I gotta get ready to go to bed so I can wake up in the morning for work. Uh, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Um, and then we'll see what we'll do. I might play either a Overwatch or Ark or uh just chatting. I don't know. It, it can go. It really just depends on how I'm feeling. But I appreciate you guys uh, hanging out with me on a chill on a chill day. We don't really have a lot. Of I mean, I feel like recently we've been having more chill streams, but it's not like it's not like a lot, a lot. If you know what I mean, it's just like every once in a while. But anyway, glad that you were able to hang out there. So, anyway, good night, guys. You take care, and um, I shall see you later. Uh, where's my thing? Uh, where is it? Where is it? Oh, here we go.